can pick up. Bitch, you know what a Honda Subaru and a Mitsubishi is. I did not pick none of that shit, bro. I was reading something. You say Yamato, motherfucker. Clearly, you don't watch anime. Dog. Nigga said Yashimitsu, motherfucker. That's Tekken. Dog. God. You got to hit that. No, that nigga's a cheat. That spin kick and shit he used to do. I used to cheat like a bitch. Bro, that shit threw me off. I didn't realize it. I ain't gonna lie. When I was younger, y'all, you, I ain't know. If, I don't know if y'all knew or not, but I used to whoop like his ass and, uh, and the other motherfuckers at certain games. But I was using cheat code, nigga. Smoke so, weed every day. So, I don't know if y'all knew I was using cheat code, and if y'all didn't, y'all let me win. Y'all some hoe ass niggas. I don't fuck with that shit, cause I don't like participation trophies, bitch. How do you know Burp despise? They are. Cause they don't move when I say honk. <laughs> How the fuck you send in ravens and shit and them motherfuckers are automatically going to that shit? Nah, them bitches been here before. Yeah, you ain't never fucking seen. Uh, he already started with the dad jokes. You ain't never seen thing. fucking. But nah, I remember I used to, what was it, Game Day 21? I said 21. Oh my god! Uh, it was like, it, was, it wasn't Madden or no shit like that. It was like Game Day. Uh, I don't know. It had my nigga Marshall Falk on the front of that bitch. Nigga, you lived with us. He's in the middle of Texas, so I know he ain't. Too much listening right now, so I gotta wait till he's done with his long ass hair trade. But that bird was a spy on fucking uh, uh, spy Incredibles. No, now you that, bird, that bird and the Tom Holland, and, oh, Tom Holland oh. and Will Smith. Oh, that nigga was a spy. They were they were spy birds. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Pulling up a hundred stars, jumping us off already. <laughs> you didn't give us a live check. <sighs> you say, and action. Anyways, can you put the HDMI in though? Cause we want to see ourselves. I want to look. That, nah, cause I think if I'm manning it right here, I gotta, I gotta be right here. So, nah, y'all need to have to chop it up. I'm at the, st- I'm I'm at the station. Pull up my own. Robert Parker, what's like happening? That Smoke that shit. Pass that, that shit. That shit. That's what bird, cause I was, I was around the time Soul came out. I was an adult. No, I ain't gonna lie, Soul was good. You right. I yeah, that nah, shit. You right. That's the same time. Pull up, y'all. We got a gang of shit to talk about today, no. y'all. It's gonna be off the fucking chain. Make sure y'all hit those likes, <laughs> shares, all that good stuff. If you just now sipping with us, exclamation notify in the chat so you don't miss none of the content. We do podcasts, game streams, and all kinds of ish over here. Pull them damn cups up. I was mad because. Motherfucker, every time you give a black person a fucking oh. movie, an animated movie, you gotta turn him into a fucking animal. I agree with that take. So, right. when we get Princess of the Frog, guess what the fuck you do? Five minutes, we get to see Louisiana, the jazz, the streets, and all the nice shit, and then bam, you turn the bitch to a frog. Are we going to the bayou. Is that racist? F- fuck yeah, it is! I, I kind of agree with him. And then you give me fucking Saw Wars, an actual dope ass movie. I'm seeing a That was legitness. And then I hurry up, you, know, you, you don't even see, he's a fucking. Something else, turn him into something else. I was like, get the fuck out of here. Niggas, niggas can't never have shit. Motherfucker, you give Snow White. Like that shit, smoke that shit, pass that shit. shit. Snow White in the Bambi and shoot that bitch. That's the fucked up. So we thugging out here. No, I just think it's kind of fucked up that you turn every black person that you give an animated movie to into some kind of fucked up character. And then they gonna give Ariel to a black person and make her a mermaid too. You fucking right, Kevin. Hell yeah. (laughs) <laughs> I'm with you, Kevin. Hell yeah. <laughs> Fucking racism. Ah, oh, goddamn it. I don't know about this. <laughs> no, I'm not reaching. Just like his ass. <laughs> no, I do agree, though. Like, in general, most of the stories, they kind of take you out of the element and do some shit like that. I'm with you on that. If what I'm, is good? If, if I'm reaching, what, what's the first black movie that a- animated that Disney did? First black animated Disney movie. I'll wait. I- Hey, them black, they them black women in Hercules didn't turn into no motherfucking animals. They was singing all the way through that bitch. Well, yeah. Yeah. Well, Hercules yeah. was a white movie. Her, they, her, they were side characters. But you, you, and they were stuck to, on the fucking pot. You know what? Hold on. Yeah, let's let now. You know, we about to continue this motherfucking topic. Pull the fuck up, y'all. Let's get it. Exactly. What? They, they turned new groove. They turned Aztec 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 groove. Buffering my point, my good sir. Any, co- any colored person turned into something. Pull up, y'all. I want to be a part of it too. Hey, the Middle Eastern. He got turned to a goat. A lion got turned into something. I don't a know. Monkey. Oh, he did get turned into a monkey. See? I don't know. 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 I don't
I mean, look, Kevin, you made Disney just lo- nah. Disney just love turning motherfuckers into animals, bro. No, loves turning niggas into animals. <laughs> yeah, correct, <laughs> <Rex, laughs> motherfucker. <I'm> <laughs> I don't subscribe to that. <laughs> Well, I man, don't subscribe yeah, to that. You don't gotta subscribe. Like giving that, it to you. Nah, anyway. look, he don't subscribe because like that picture, he trying to deal more into his lighter side. <laughs> <laughs> he, done, he done got the bleach effect and shit. So you know what I'm saying? I was darker in that picture. <laughs> he got that Sammy Sosa. Hey, talk to me that box cutter there right there though. Hey, sippers, pull up, y'all. This is the Drink the Kool Aid podcast. We are freaking live. It is me, Archie Red, the Kool Aid Man. We're doing something a little bit different here on this one. Let us know, y'all, how it works out for you. Do not forget to pull up those mother freaking topics right on over there on that prompt so we can get to those. But we got motherfucking sweet me. That would be me. And if you do not want the sweet me applied to your woman, Take care of her for this Christmas. Take her to see the light. Go get her some hot cocoa. Otherwise, the sweet meat will be in effect. Okay? Okay, don't go to work. He sees you when you're sleeping. He I know knows when, when you're, you're awake. So <laughs> Motherfuckers went in straight stalker mode all of a sudden. Like, just don't go to sleep. <laughs> so don't you, go to sleep. <laughs> so when you go to work at night, I'm in your jizz sheets. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> And then we got he Big lives, Taliban. Oh, I was gonna say he lives in the pipe. I'm a wonder to see. Sponge, bomb, square pants. Hey, <laughs> not too much on the hair today, you know what I'm saying? I'm bringing back the old swag. Yeah, cause for some reason Portia look like she in straight roasting mode right now. Like I see her about to go all the oh, way no, in. Oh, Portia oh. mad that we got on her last time. <laughs> I've been letting you make it, Portia. You Portia. was with me all stream the other day. You want to hear that? Or the week before, I don't think. I let you fuck. No, nah, last week, we let her have it. Nah, yeah, we nah, did. We did. We got I, let you f- I let you fuck with Bradley all day Monday. So I didn't give you no shit. Uh, hey, and a shout out to I'm Jeff for pulling up those 100 stars. Aaron Landrum pulling up that like. Thank y'all so much. Hey, for real, for real. I need y'all pulling up y'all's topic requests on that prompt so we can get to and talk about the things that y'all want to talk about. Like, we talk about everything besides politics and shit. So if y'all want us to talk about more sports shit and get up in here, y'all need to chop it up with us, you know what I'm saying, and rock with us. If y'all want us, you know what I'm saying, to review somebody terrible ass music, then send us that shit. If you want us to, like, whatever the fuck y'all want us to talk about, pull up. Ruben, I see you with that like. He say Brad gave me twenty five dollars. Oh snap! Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Why you gotta put my boy on blast like that? What you do for that twenty five? What you do for that twenty five? Hold on, hold on. Cake. Right, uh, 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 hey, uh, it's not her little throwback, man. Oh, yeah. They, 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 they say, oh, hump day. Oh, yeah. They saw that. They was like, oh, that's Porsche? Let's celebrate hump day before this Wednesday. These motherfuckers oh, think they out. slick out there. Nah, hey, them, them motherfuckers be in there wild and wild. Now, let's get to what the fuck are people doing because, y'all, I'm telling you. I'm telling y'all, we off the chain today. We off the chain today. We lit. Super lit. Yo, Kevin, yeah, you All got right. the floor, bruh. All right, you so got the floor. One of them, I got is what the fuck are people doing? What the is, you know, last week Let's see we if any of y'all done pulled up any questions yet. We got that one dog that, you know, shot his own owner. Ah! So they this put week, him down? Nah, <laughs> he said, don't be I got no one problems. better. <laughs> his cousin up the street in Kilgore decided that, you know, Grandpa in the, in the Walmart getting his diaper rash medication. I'm going to let him hop up in the whip and drive down the street. Damn. And, and uh... Turned out a little dog ended up running over. <laughs> the dog drove the car? Yeah, the dog. The, dog. The, the owner put the leash around the, the stick. Dog. And, oh, and, and the dog moved and the stick jumped because it was an old old car. Oh. And the car, it moved from park to neutral. Threw that bitch in first. Oh, uh, no, and it rolled. And he, uh, and he took that bitch on the door, right? Damn, bro, this is back to back. At first, you bring us the dog shooting the motherfucker yeah. with the shot of and now these motherfuckers no, running motherfuckers Morty over. coming true. <laughs> you bro, try to take over. I was at the gym last night, and they fucked up my whole workout because I don't know if y'all ever heard, I don't, sippers, I don't know if y'all ever heard of Chive TV or whatever, where it just be like just random viral shit that be going on, and they just collage that shit together. Yeah. Nigga, so these cops pull up. And at first, I'm thinking it's a Karen, right? Yeah. Sitting here just being nosy, thinking like somebody done locked their dog in a car or something. So, oh, well, I'm thinking I should go over there and, you know, break the window. And somebody's like, no, don't do that. And they pan the camera over, and there's a big-ass fucking bear over here by this fucking car that's just going crazy. I'm like, why the fuck is this bear going crazy? Well, turns out 
that um the lights inside the car start flickering and they're like, oh, they done hit the lights now. So I'm like, damn, is this a fucking mutant dog? Like, is this motherfucking crypto or whatever? You know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck is going on in this bitch? <laughs> no, there are two fucking baby bears in the fucking car fucking with the lights, and then they opened the door and got out that bitch to go back over there to my, I don't even know how the fuck they got in the fucking car and locked the door. The shit was fucking crazy. I'm telling you, bro, I'm sitting there in a full fucking, I'm doing shoulder raises, bro, and I. So you know how. Hey, boo-boo. <laughs> nah, look, see, I know how that movie coming out with the, with the, with the bear that got the, the premium. Bradley, movie. what's happening? The, the new, the new movie oh, with yeah, the bear, the that bear. bear. Nah, he got that premium Peruvian cocaine. It's Colombian. Prob- Shout out my nigga. Peruvian. 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 Premium Peruvian cocaine. Peruvian. Peruvian. No, nah, see, that ain't how you said. You said, cookie. <laughs> That's how you went in with it. I remember. Because I've been dying on this shit. That premium Peruvian cocaine. Is that... Jeez. That's the, that's the, those are children Gotta have that, gotta have that feel behind it. Those are the children Nah, Cocaine Bear is gonna be fucking hilarious, though. Y'all know it. That movie's gonna be freaking that hilarious. Nigga. Bradley, thanks for that like. I appreciate nigga, it. What you just described is the sequel, nigga. And Portia, thanks for those cups. Pull up y'all. Hey, I need y'all. I need our comment section super popping today. We're going to be hella quick on y'all's reactions and everything. I need y'all to pull them things up. Portia say you look lost. Who? I look lost? Yes, you, Kev. Okay. Damn. What's next on what the fuck are people doing? Okay, so this is, I thought this was kind of fucked up. Uh, a polygamous cult leader tried to bribe his teenage daughter to marry him for a bag of Doritos and $50. That, that sounds like a good deal to me. FBI says. Like he trying to wait. That sounds like a good deal. Cult to me. leader, daughter, to his own daughter. Here's a bag of Doritos. This motherfucker's gonna be yeah. out in a week. Yeah. He's gonna be out in a week. Is this somewhere in Alabama or Hazel, Texas? This nigga, they in Westeros. This nigga about to be out in a week. Oh, Westeros. They Makes in, sense. They in Westeros. I want a dragon. They Westeros. He gonna be out in a week Damn, and ain't gonna do no without no bail. I'm telling you, he about to get out. Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah, just like all this Tom Hansen people. That nigga getting out, bro. Nah, because they know that this motherfucker only did this shit so his <laughs> dumb ass could fucking go viral. Ain't nobody fucking buying that shit. No. Bro, you, okay, you're what's the one thing in a cult? You mind David control Grinch. over motherfuckers, right? You know yeah. what I'm saying? How God, the... Damn. Bro. And it's quiet. You keep it quiet. First of all, you the worst cult leader. You the worst cult leader ever, bro. Yo, when you... It. You sat, you sat there, you offered some shit, and they didn't even buy into your shit. They went and snitched on your ass. Like, bro, you terrible. Shut your fucking cult down, fam. They do not follow you. <laughs> you probably you probably just got good weed and good food over there. You know what I'm saying? And they homeless and want to rock with you. <laughs> like Bradley said, hell, I marry him for Doritos and $25. What you talking about? I mean, I, he probably offered. I'm just saying it's kind of fucked up. In what flavor Doritos? I was going to say. <laughs> it's cool it's probably the nachos. <laughs> it was probably the nachos why she snitched. But if it was the That's because cool he didn't. Oh, that's because he didn't offer to make real nachos with those nacho cheese Doritos. He fucking up on See, his pimping. Nah, if you would have gave me some, if you gave salsa me verde. Like, hey, bro, hey, 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 gourmet like a some bitch up in that bitch. <laughs> Ratatouille <laughs> all up in that hoe. Hey, throwing lie. down. He offering me Doritos. In reality, I want some Funyuns. Hot Funyuns. Hot nah. oh, God. I am a hot Cheeto baby. Okay, see, I like <laughs> Funyuns and hot Funyuns I was in love for, but the roof of my mouth Nigga. is like a bowl of No, Portia, I have milk. not seen I have not seen that movie, Keep <laughs> no, Sweet, no, on no. Netflix. Uh, in reality, in reality, <laughs> rubbing that shit wrong. In reality, yeah. he, he didn't offer her the right combination. He should have offered her a His gift. daughter. Bo Loco. He should have offered his daughter. I don't give a fuck. He shit. He, he there now. If you dare go all the way with it, god damn it. Shit. So, he there. What the fuck? He should have offered her some hot fries and a brisk. Okay, okay. Ha, ha, the nigga said breakfast she, 24. <laughs> Twisted T would have got that mind right. High school breakfast. Or, oh, or oh, guys, she ain't got to drink that. <laughs> Why are we campaigning for this motherfucker? Why are we telling her to take the fucking deal? Are we ignoring the biggest part of this? You said this What's was the cult? Who was this chick? Uh, I don't know. The cult leader. Daughter. Shit, nigga, deal or no deal. And right now, the oh, deal fuck. is wrong. That's what I'm saying. His middle name is Rapy, Rapy Lee. <laughs> this shit fake, bro. That whole fucking headline gotta be fake. <laughs> no, no, I'm being dead ass. <laughs> they gotta be Florida, man, right? 
That so y'all, y'all, y'all want to talk about Florida man? I got a Florida man you story. You got a Florida man? I got a Florida man story. Florida man, what do you do? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, so this, <laughs> this on this edition, because y'all know anytime we pull up, what the fuck are people doing? I automatically think we going to Florida. Sempers, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> so uh, yeah. let's go. <laughs> right now, we got a Florida man arrested for allegedly having sex with a dog in public, mm-hmm. damaging church nativity scene. Huh? What? Repeat that. Yeah, we were laughing at your little chair over here. They finally saw your little setup right here, so now they laughing at how you sitting in the chair. They finally able to see what you look like, and so they laughing. They laughing, laughing at your chair. <laughs> <laughs> Man, fuck y'all. <laughs> 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 nah, what happened? I, cause I think I heard about this story. No, I say a Florida man has been arrested after he had sex with a dog in front of people, Whoa. damaged the church nativity scene, and attempted <laughs> to steal a vehicle. <laughs> Not the nativity scene. Damn, oh, you damn. not throwing it. He, he was wise just, men, bro. This motherfucker went <laughs> for broke, bro. This was, bro. He, he, was, was, he was just trying to give it a little accuracy. On Sunday, police in Clearwater arrested 36-year-old Chad Mason on charges including sexual activity with an animal. Exposing sexual organs and criminal mischief to a place of worship. I got, I got, a, I got a dad joke. Damn. I got a dad joke. What's up, man? Freemason. <laughs> Kevin, you should be laughing. Yeah, of man. all the motherfuckers here, you should be <laughs> fucking was, laughing. Why aren't you fucking laughing, Kevin? That wasn't that good. On Sunday, oh no, 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 I already said that part. Kids. According to authorities, Mason was walking a golden doodle. Wait, a, a golden what? Golden Doodle. <laughs> yeah, oh, I swear this is real. Was watching, was walking a Golden Doodle owned by someone he knows at approximately 4.30 p.m. when he publicly had sex with the dog in front of witnesses, including a child who was younger than Not 16. Bear. Oh, my God. I knew a Golden Doodle. He can't do that to Bear. That's fucked up. Yeah. When he was approached by one of the witnesses, he reportedly fled the scene and began to wreak havoc in the surrounded areas. When he was confronted by someone that at the apartment complex Scott there, he ran from the scene and began to wreak havoc in the surrounding area. Authorities said, per the New York Post, what the fuck is the New York Post doing in Miami? It is unclear if he was walking the dog with permission or if took the dog without asking the owner. At this point, who gives a fuck? Who's you are targeted? fucking a dog in public. It, it, As opposed to being in private? This fucking... Bro. Let me tell you something. Actually... I got something to say. What my nigga say on on on, on uh, Talladega Nights? Baby hey. Jesus is my favorite baby. My baby mm-hmm. Jesus is my favorite Jesus. That's the Jesus I'm praying to. Baby mm-hmm. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I, hope fuck, I hope they ain't fuck. I hope they fuck with Talladega baby Jesus. Is? Ricky Bobby. Do the Ricky Bobby stop. Alexa, pull up with that Ooh, like. Thank movie. you so much. Will, Will uh, Ferrell. That's oh, why I yeah. fucking he, he watch it. He don't fuck with Will Ferrell. Oh. He said, baby Jesus, my favorite baby Jesus. That's the, that's the only you, just, you gotta be, you know what I'm saying? But I want you, can't you be like, I want to be like a, like a, like a lovable crackhead, you know, one who's like sensitive to people's feelings. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, you are, bro, you are missing out, fam. That hoe funny than a bitch. Bro, that said, that hoe funny than a bitch. Step brothers either, huh? Nope. Good God, bro. bro you, the you, the one failure. movie I got, the one movie I got stuck to watching was the one with uh, Mark Wahlberg and The Rock, or Rock, Mark Wahlberg and Samuel L. Jackson. The, uh, oh, the other guys, guys. And, your yeah. reason for, and your reason for even turning that off is on some bullshit. That was pretty good, too. I oh, know, I finished watching it. Oh, you hey, did? For the I thought that was one you turned off. <laughs> <laughs> so you finished it? Yeah, I finished oh, it. Oh, shit. But it did piss <laughs> you off, though, that they teased yeah, you yeah, thought yeah, that yeah, they were going to be in the fucking movie, and they wasn't in there. Boy. Fucking die out the window. The nigga said, aim for the bushes, nigga. There was no bushes down there, nigga. The niggas was on the floor. That's how I knew it was some straight bullshit. <laughs> Out of there. Okay, what else you got on what the fuck are people doing? All right, so this guy, uh, That's fucked up. He, the, these cops post a warrant. You know, you know they post the warrant around Little up. baby Jesus and his little baby manager. So this guy. <laughs> I don't think that's what he's asking. <laughs> Not still major. These cops went on Facebook. You know, every cop, every city got a cop police department Facebook. Yeah. Right. Well, it's in Dallas. But this guy, you know, they post the roundup of what wars are going out for. He's like, hey, I got one. Is it that one? So the guy goes, hey, you ain't missing me. And they said, no, he don't. And yeah, oh, that's it. No, he don't. We got you. He said, we coming to get you right now. Yeah. <laughs> and so that's exactly what happened. They triangulated his shit, had a war, he came and arrested his ass. Yeah. 
Yeah. No. Dumbass in the same way. Trying to vein. flex, trying to flex on the gram. That's what your ass get. Oh, you gonna be flexing? I right? gonna be the, flexing them cheeks while your ass. Flexing them cheeks. Oh God, it was the city's most wanted, and he knew he was one of them, so he got up on their flex. Oh, but y'all ain't got me on there. There you go. That's what oh, there you go. Sure enough, they posted what that nigga was on it. Thanks for the share. Hold on. Same vein. I was gonna say that they they did that little cool <laughs> Mexican shit. flu. And bro, bro, a dude commenting on that motherfucker. He say, uh, hey, look, I see I'm on that bitch, but y'all gonna have to come find me. They they they, they commented. They say, no, it's all good. We'll give you a ride. Just let us know where you at. He was like, oh man, y'all ain't gonna come to my part of the hood, bro. I'll let y'all know when I get there. And they just commented back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. I'm like, bro, y'all childish. Bro, because that's how, bro. They, like these police departments, social media sites done turned into like Wendy's Twitter. Oh, Where these motherfuckers be going <laughs> in now, bro? Like they right. don't, they don't right. give a fuck, bro. These police to see Donald Trump act a fool, and they was like, "Fuck it, we gotta go in." I, I mean, mean, bro, let's be real. Military equipment. Why can't we? Why, use it? why can't <laughs> the we? The internet. Fuck. That's crazy. Do we have any more? What the fuck are people doing? Uh, I think that was my last one. All right, so let's go ahead and get to some of these super. Questions right here. Bradley say, "Don't put raisins in the potato salad." Y'all are using the question spot no. as a spot to, to talk shit. Do not. I Eric, repeat. Proportion. Do not put raisins in the fucking potato. Eric, I was gonna say we should be past that, but we do have one more holiday where I don't want no raisins in my cornbread. So, so we have to keep on. We have to be on your ass until the New Year. After New Year's, you got till Fourth of July to come back around, and then we're gonna get back on your ass. I'll ask you in June. <laughs> I'm about ready for my nigga to turn into Aang with that stick behind him, though. Oh, yeah. Uh, hey, that's all real I'm going to tell you. Hope he about to, hope he about to said, flip into some wild shit, yo. Said, like, hey, for real, for real. That stick automatically makes you look like you could fuck somebody up with that bitch. She said, I had some one time. She said, one time. One time. Yes. Y'all won't let me. That's all it that's all matter. I that's fucked all up. Hey, I fucked up. I fucked up sweet with, meat. because of one fucking time. I don't do that shit often. I'm shit. hazelnut, and I didn't even make the shit. Okay, because my ankles might have been oh, flimsy right. like three, four times. Now I got to be ankles. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't one. He the only one that shit happened a couple times, too. Oh, damn, you baby deer. <laughs> ankles don't recover. That nigga bam be like a motherfucker. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I heels on. <laughs> hey, did I, I ain't know Bambi was a dude. I was a mama guy. I guess that's that deer looking like he was dead. Huh? I remember when Bambi was on that ice, boy. Yeah, that's how your ass be looking. Bradley Damn. says cornbread should not have sugar in it either. Now, hold on. Tripping. No, he's Smoking. right. No, I'm with it. I hate niggas that make jiggy. What? I hate niggas that make jiggy. Yeah, sweet shit, cornbread? Bro, go make a cake. Go make a fucking pound cake if bro, you want sweet cornbread. First off, that's, you don't want a cake. You want cornbread, but sweet. No. Then, no, nigga, you do something else. Don't you're not you supposed to make it too fucking jiffy. sweet though. Huh? It's not supposed to be a fucking salt. cake. Fuck sweet. jiffy, nigga. Your shit better be from scratch. Corn starch. All right, so you fuck with the sugar, right? Corn meal. Okay, can you make? I'm about to yes. go. Yes. I'm about to go. I'm about to go in, bro. I got you. Yes. Because see, I can. Yes, I'm I can. no. I'm with. I, first off, I'm with you when you say fuck when you when you with the jiffy thing because yeah, you might as well just bring some ice into that bitch and go ahead and throw down. But okay. to say that shit does not belong <laughs> in fucking cornbread. Hey, first of all. I don't know if y'all motherfuckers ever ate cornbread with the actual corn in it. And then you have a little hit of that bitch up in there. I'm telling you. I I'm telling you. Like, because I know, look, because the, that, that, because listen, I love soul food cornbread. But at the same time, guess what I can't do with soul food cornbread? I can't have that shit wrapped up like how we did at fucking Sprouts or whatever and go throughout my day fucking eating that shit. Because if I do, guess what? I'm going to need a fucking pitcher of water. I, no, I guess the one I can't stay. No, 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 wait. You stay, puppy. you stay with us. So you know, when I say that shit shouldn't be sweet, I mean that shit shouldn't taste like cake. Like with fucking pasta and spaghetti and shit, motherfuckers. <laughs> oh, damn. Wait, nigga, y'all put sugar in y'all spaghetti already. No, that, listen, everything. Now I know why you don't like fucking Requires a, like, a touch of sugar. Because it knocks off certain flavors. But. If your shit tastes like you dumped half the bag of sugar in your cornbread, I'm sorry, fam. Keep that shit. that shit. It shouldn't be. I'm not saying I want dry, un like untasting type cornbread. It's straight bread, bread. My shit should taste the sweetness. <coughs> the sweetness though should be complemented almost by the butter. You see what I'm saying? So it should be moist enough to where it's like when you taste it, like, oh, this is fucking corn. You know what I'm saying? It's cornbread. 
I don't want to taste it. It's it's like, cool. is this fucking like vanilla? Shit, you know what I'm and that's what fucking Jiffy tastes like. Where's the extract? <laughs> oh, like, like, bitch, why I taste straight sugar when I bite into your cornbread, man? I could, like, nah, 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 bro. I want corn. Look at it. It's corn. A big lump of corn. It Cream corn. <laughs> Hell no. Nah. Hey, mom. Yeah. Belly. Alright. I love you, man. Bye. So do y'all got y'all got anything else for what the fuck are people doing? Was that, was that every day? That's everything. That's everything. All right. So the next thing I have on there is fuck. All right. <laughs> fuck. So I, got a, I got an off the wall question for y'all. All right. So check it. Fuck your hottest celebrity. Right. Like it's you got the juice. Like, you get a chance to smash. Smash, but they got a dick. What? So you oh, that, I don't know who that was on that buddy cop movie where they kept asking each other questions <coughs> like that, but this nigga on that type of shit. And I'm just gonna say this. Or no, pick Vin Diesel with a pistol. You talking about lesbian cops? Is that what that is? Nah, it was. It's an older movie than that where they just sitting there. So would you do this, 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 or this? And they just sitting there doing that the whole movie. And I'm like, fam, nah, I'm good. Nah, he good. But neither. Yeah. I will, I'm celibate. <laughs> I mean, it's just like a book. I have taken. A voluntary celibacy for the rest of my fucking life. I'm sorry. I'm not gonna listen to family as I'm in the. No. No. I'm not gonna do that shit every time. Family. 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 <laughs> family. No, I'm good, fam. You good. You wanna make a family. <laughs> I'm not. Let's go half on the family. Oh, I am Groot. That nigga gonna be like, Groot. 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 No. Nah, I am Groot. Nah, he mo- he's an iron giant. <laughs> he gonna be making a. He all of them shits. No, nigga. I'm not doing none of that shit. You fucking up all my childhoods right now, and I'm good. And I wasn't even a child when I watched Groot, motherfucker. Ah, uh, damn it. <laughs> nigga talking about You say he fucking up his childhood, and he wasn't even a child. <laughs> I'm not. You said, like. I didn't figure out about Groot. That shit was so wild, I forgot yeah, the I'm question. Not doing either one, dog. <laughs> So, yo, like, <laughs> I just stick to the regular bitches. Yo, so that, 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 oh, God. <laughs> so that's that's Kevin for you, Portia. You know this. Yo, this motherfucker wild like that. I don't even want to hit a crush. celebrity crush. Yo, celebrity, yo, crush. celebrity crush got a dick. <laughs> or Vin Diesel. <laughs> or Vin Diesel with a pussy. With the moistness. <laughs> the wetness of the wops. <laughs> what is that? Swole body the most still. Vis- the small mo- body No, no, no. Still. Look, okay. look, Vin Diesel with the most viscous of inners. <laughs> Nigga still Mia Williams, thank you so much for the like. I'm so sorry you came in and had to we jump in like weird right shit. on this part. <laughs> weird shit. This, this is Kevin for you, this though. Kevin. Oh, this is Kevin. This is Kevin. The thoughts and opinions well, of Kevin doing, do Kevin? not uh, represent fucking... drank the Kool Aid. Uh, wasn't... <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what you going with? Group or, or just I gotta go with a dick? I gotta go with Groot. <laughs> Niggas say he gonna go with the viscous inners. He ain't dealing with it just now. Hey. hey, look, I'm sorry, Scarlet, but uh, you got to take that penis somewhere. <laughs> 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 look, Holly Berry, I love you, but I see you fucking Damn. late. You better make sure your room is pitch black. <laughs> hey, 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 I see what you did there. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> he gonna be going through. He gonna be going through the chronicles of ridiculous. <laughs> this motherfucker said, "Yeah, hit that shit." This motherfucker hit, but that, bro, I'm I'm not even fucking answering that question. That that's fuck. That's not. I can't fucking stick to the regular dick. Bitches. I don't need no celebrity. <coughs> fuck that. <coughs> I'm right handed. Fuck that shit. <laughs> you hear me? No, I'm left because you got dab niggas up there right now. I'm gonna start giving you niggas fist, fist bump that's right handed. Fuck that <laughs> shit. You right handed, you got fist bump me. Then A. Hey. Don't dab me up, you nasty motherfucker. But A. Hey. <laughs> then A. Hey. I don't disrespect you motherfuckers by dabbing you up with my left hand. Huh? Yeah. Shit. So keep your cum hands away from me, motherfucker. Shit. Hope you see somebody that's ambidextrous. Yeah, that's, I, I, wasn't even trying to, I wasn't trying to go that deep or nothing like that. <laughs> But then this nigga, leave it up to Kevin. Just leave, leave it up to you Kevin. You leave the door open. I'm going to kick it closely hey, look, unless you, the other way. Look, unless you got Me, I'm sorry. We foot kicking, bitch, because you going to always have some shoes on or some socks, motherfucker. We're going to, hey, 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 mm-hmm. like we fucking doing some soccer shit. Now you got to get that kid and play on niggas and shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? No, because you got to touch hands and bounce around. Fuck that shit. No, you don't. Not on kid and play. You ain't got to touch your hands and say, hell no. That's straight feet and heels. Nope. You got a foot fetish. 
That's the reason why well, you make me. everything That's fucking with me. God nah, damn, I can't have shit. So why you looking at his feet? Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, Porsche said I'll take Harry, Henry Cavill with the pussy. <laughs> she said, but that don't count. That can go for y'all. Y'all can do that shit. We can't do that shit. We can't, nah, that shit don't work for us, so fuck that. I, no, I, that's boy, like, damn no, it. No, I'm saying, that's okay for them. It's okay. About. Damn near every girl on, buy, bro. I've been saying, say, pussy on pussy is okay, but dick on dick is always gonna start a fire. <laughs> <laughs> Two stinks start a fire. <laughs> God damn it. I'm sorry, we going to hell. I don't care, but I got my gasoline drawers. You got yours? Ah, uh, I won up, she. <laughs> <laughs> so... Call of Duty on the Nintendo Switch. Uh, is, that, is that just as bad as Apex? That. Is that just as bad as Apex? I don't know, but Phil Spencer <laughs> say he's dedicated to the next 10 Jeez. years of bringing Call of Duty to the Nintendo Switch. What do y'all think that's gonna? Y'all think that's gonna? The last help, time yep. it was on the Switch, it failed. What? I think I think they have, it was a port and it was horrible. I was gonna say, but they have a chance. Right, because most of the time the thing with the switches and I was just Butler, like, what's happening? Pull up, bro. How you doing? I was just watching some about ports to uh, switches not too long ago. Yeah, and, they're and the thing, they are most of the time. But the thing is, most of the time they like they they could be consist like mm, comparable to mobile ports, right? Like the games on mobile phones. So a lot of motherfuckers love Call of Duty mobile. <coughs> Niggas be on Call of Duty Mobile like a motherfucker. Nah, but they're not. But they're not doing. They're not doing. They're not talking about just doing like a Call of Duty Mobile on the Switch. No, talking no, I, about, I, I get that. But what I'm saying is, is that if they implement the same type of uh, mechanics and things that they got on the mobile side, because the the Switch can't run the graphics and everything That's and everything what I'm saying. else. What the fuck y'all doing? They should be okay with a mobile type. You know what I'm saying? Version of it. They, it's gonna be. It's not gonna be the same as playing it on your fucking. I'm about to console. say. I, I'm not about to play on my PS5 and play with niggas on an Xbox and a computer, and my game gonna look different because I got a fucking switch that, to get my lobby. It's not. That's what I'm saying. So don't look at it like that because it's not gonna be like like with all games. If it's Switch, nigga, Switch Online is exclusive to Switch Online. You're not gonna go and play. They're not about to be playing with us with or us anything. And, and if they and if they do and if they do. <laughs> I'd be surprised, bro. So if what would be the point of getting Call of Duty on the Switch then? Because they I don't know, have it. No, because there's work. certain people that only play Switch. No, no, no. You actually, you know what? Hold on. There, there actually may be a loophole. And it's a mobile game. No, nah, there may be, there may be a loophole. There may be a loophole around this because think of it this way: What's the one reason that people on consoles don't like playing with the people on PC <laughs> when they do the cross gen thing? Not just cheating, Man, but because of the mouse response time it's and because on PCs, PC shit, the bro. PCs and shit, like the way that they see, the way that they, it's like, okay, for instance, the, re, the, same, the same reason that they wouldn't let next gen play with current gen on Call of Duty because if I'm on next gen, my resolution and all that type of shit is going to be sharper, so I'm going to have the advantage on you. can see you. a bit farther. It's not, it's not just a block. But what it's people sleep on, though, bro, is the Switch is still one of the most powerful consoles out there. Like, that bitch is powerful than a bitch. It's just so, the screen is so small, the resolution is bad. So if they, right, like but with they, but with the new one that they just dropped, you know what I'm saying, and with them building it from the ground up, not doing, because what they're not, they're not going to do, they're not going to do what they did on the last one. This was going to be this, while it's going to be Call of Duty, it's going to be built for the Nintendo. They're not going to fuck up. And that, that's what I'm saying. You know what I'm I saying? So that, go ahead. Because Nintendo, uh, I think I was watching basically just Switch over the years. That was the video I was watching. Of just Bradley say put mobile and Switch together. Ba yeah, I would agree because they basically the same shit. And it's like think about that's it. legit. You, your crowd, your crowd, your crowd and your base would be good on that because you can let console players do their thing, but you still wouldn't negate that other fan base because it's already known that Call of Duty got people who work on the console side that they got a whole division <laughs> that's just mobile only. Exactly, and I think. Switch. I've never played mobile Call of Duty. Bro, right. this, it's, 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 it's not bad, bro. It's not bad. I tell you like this, I like their customizing and unlockable things. That format that they have is a lot better than what not, we have on console when it granted, comes to skins. It don't, uh, it don't take the place of console Call of Duty. So don't look at it like that. But say if you was how I used to be back in the day on the train or like you know what I'm saying when we rolling on the train or you always on the go, you Man, always out and about. Out you there. at Starbucks because you want what's called. You can't hook up your console. But you a Call of Duty head, you just want to shoot some niggas. You know what uh -huh. I mean? So pull that switch still, out. In the switch, you ain't gotta worry about the funky ass mechanics on your phone. That's the you ain't thing. gotta go buy an adapter for a controller to make it work on your phone. 
pull that bitch out. I already got the burden. I already got the layout. Motherfucking Isham with that share, bro. Hey, y'all better get like homie. Y'all now, I see you up in there with that share as well, man. Hey, pull up. He look, he look just like the dude the, 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 the that popped up. What these niggas that popped up? Oh, oh shit. shit. VJ, I see you, bro. I see you. Hey, he just said a controversial ass statement. What's up? Say that shit again. Say that I had the uh, fucking black ops on the weed, bro, and that shit was hard. Like, nigga, that shit, you was out there with the actual, you know what I'm saying, pointing at the screen, and then had to reload that bit. Uh, uh, uh. Zombies was fun, play. though. Lit on the I week, think, dog. I think the thing that that hurt that part because they could they had they could have success. They the looked, sensor on that bitch though was fucking like straight ass grease and butter. It gave me they uh, had bigger sensors. I mean, they had a because even it though, was like eighty dollars. I do remember y'all did have a big. Ass hey y'all, now see what you did there, pull up. Because even the hunter games on there, they had potential to be super fun because they took you back to them fucking analog. Uh, remember the games that you plug in the fucking gun into your TV? Bradley yeah, PC yeah, not better than console, bro. Duck like Hunt. Me and Isaiah was talking prices. about this shit the other day, or whatever. PC is not better than console, bro. At all, y'all while you like, while yeah. y'all may be able to like, while you know, say be able to like mod, enhance, and stuff like that, it's just. Why, you, got too much why do y'all think do arcades are still around? Motherfuckers is in that hole going hard, nigga, on the little console, little gaming, nigga, all that, bro. Shit, yeah. For a while, you can play arcades. For, for a while, the arcade systems were stronger than the shit that was at the house. Oh, yeah, like, yeah, people yeah. would get bad when they would port some shit from the arcades to, like, the Sega or Nintendo, and they'd be like, man, what the fuck is this shit? Uh -huh. It's not hitting like, yeah. Because them shits just ain't hitting the fucking same. But, uh, so, I mean, I think so. But, like, are y'all with... All right, Kevin sounds like he basically know for Call of Duty going over to the Switch. He don't think that shit's going to work. I think, I think, personally, I think there's... And you can tell me if I'm wrong. But, You're wrong. Fuck you, bitch. Hey. But, uh, wrong. You prefer playing games at the crib, though, right? Like, on your shit. <laughs> on the, on the, what's called it, right? No. Um, like, you don't play too many mobile games, do you? Yeah. I'm not saying usually when I'm mobile, I'm doing shit. Mobile. Right. Yeah. That's what I'm, so, that's why I think that wouldn't even, they wouldn't even try to cater to Kevin, in my opinion. Say you go on no one plane. ever caters to the lights. Say you get on a plane, bro. Anymore. Say you on a plane, bro. You got your switch, bro. Nah, nah, nah. Hell, nah, nah. y'all hella cater to it. All the motherfuckers be doing is crying. On a boat. Oh, you on a yacht. Dark. You want a cruise? No, I'm on a shit. Boat. I'm just What's dark as shit. Watch you. We got. We can actually go back and forth on who dark is. We, we can have. We can have a simple comment on that. We nah, ain't the same deal. Hey, look, look. We ain't got different look. camera quality. Yeah, you know, now. So, nah, nah, nah. That shit actually kind of fucking. Them shit's yeah. Them shit's actually kind of hitting though. Yeah, this hoes kind of hitting. This hoes exactly hitting for real. For real. Hell no. Hell no. For real though. Man, we talking about he said boats. He said something about a boat. I said nigga, nah. Boats. and hoes. Boats. and hoes. Boats. and hoes. Boats. and hoes. Don't even know about that. Oh my god. You don't even know about that. Damn, I took my fucking The boats and hoes with him and homie from Step Brothers, the video oh, that they oh, did. Oh yeah, yeah. I, I was Step Brothers. Motherfucker didn't watch Step Brothers. That's what I was gonna start doing. I was gonna start singing the song. That's why I was like, wait, boats and hoes. I was just like singing that. Got he said, why Archie by himself? Do he got the 19? See, why you coming up? <laughs> yeah, he in a whole different room. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, oh, yeah. hold up. Oh, yeah. We got a new sipper. A not Iram Sire. Hey, I hit that hoe all the way right that time. I didn't fuck that up one bit. Holler at your boy. Yo, we need cups up in the chat right now for our new sipper. For real, for real. Y'all, y'all been lighting up the chat, but go ahead and represent and let them know. Helping you out. They so good, even die better can drink it, bro. And they ain't followers, they family around here. Pull them shits up. Nah, we're gonna give everybody getting a nickname. You just gotta be in here long enough and tell us a story. That's it. Once you tell us a story, you getting the nickname. And it hit the lot. And we got a like. I see I already see see you already oh, yeah. a cool sipper. Super you real. engaging, Absolutely. doing all of that shit. That's that's what I love to see right there. That's what I love to see. But I, sippers, I need cups up for our new sipper who just got up in here though. Portia, you know what Bradley, I'm saying? Like pull them things up. Portia and Bradley, be nice. Quincy, you too. Don't don't don't, don't scare him away. Let let them let let them breathe for a second, and then you then you can get it. You know what I'm saying? Hayes Marie Tanya, that's dope. That's dope. I actually like that. That name backwards is Hayes Marie Tanya. Oh, that's cold. Backwards. That's that's dope as hell. That's cold. In the that that that's fresh as hell. Bradley, I, I didn't even catch that. Mia Yatna. 
VJ, yo, appreciate that, y'all. For real, for real. Thank y'all so much for pulling those cups up, showing our sippers how we do things right out here. Look at that. Who that popping bottles? Porsche popping bottles up in here. We popping champagne like we want our championship game. And I got a bottle of championship ring, cause I'm out of water. Young Weezy, I'm out of water. And I didn't remember me. And I didn't get I don't know what the fuck y'all talking about. Stop this But, uh, nah, bro, nah, but real, on some real shit, though. <laughs> what up? This Halo update, fam, you gonna love this shit. No, I'm not. You are bullshit. They gave me multiplayer? B bro. They say, give me fucking more. Can we go play that bitch together on the co-op thing, on the campaign? Nigga, Can we go kill grunts? That shit gonna be an afterthought when when you fucking hear this shit. We can't kill grunts. No, 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 no. Hold on. See, watch this. Watch this. Y'all, listen to me, but look at him. You know what I'm saying? Listen to me, but look at him. The Winter Update's most notable addition had to be Forge. So, yes. Forge... Now in Halo Infinite, something this motherfucker been crying, was just crying last week about, is finally fucking available. Hello? Hello? Uh, yeah, I... Halo Infinite's map creator, but now the December update provides even more free content to support it. This includes shiny new custom game browser, which for Halo I feel is legit, because there are times where I'm just wanting to run TDM only and that type shit, and I'm not trying to cycle through some of that other shit that y'all got going on. So a custom game browser, I feel like it's going to be real legit for uh, really just for the uh, the game setup, period. And then there's uh, uh, it's a key support structure for what players create in Forge and a pillar for the community. So with this, what's going to happen with this is not only are you going to be able to like search games and shit like that, but you will also be able to go in and navigate your way through forge because let's be real with that shit already being out there's already thousands of creations like now blood gulch is already out like they're, they're, they're the shit's already they're out so when you come across your shit yeah you may have your favorites but let's be real sometimes we get in the mode and we be fucking forgetting to fucking mash the button we just on to the next match on to the next match nah you could actually browse through and find what the fuck you looking for on that bitch so i think with between I, I feel what you're saying on the multiplayer you, you thing. Got me, motherfucker. You got me. You got me. You got me. Because that's what's going to keep that bitch alive. You got me. It took him long enough. God damn it. But I oh, 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 hold on. I'm not done. Oh, you're not I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not but done. But wait, there's more. <laughs> <laughs> it says, so. okay, so you'll be able to access community-created content with ease. As part of the update, 343 Industries has also rebuilt and reintroduced beloved Halo 3 map, The Pit, using Forge. Okay. But it will now go by a different name, uh, Empyrean, I believe is what it's saying here. The new map is a faithful reimagining of the Halo 3 favorite with Both refreshed the aesthetics. aesthetics. I was going to say with the assets that they got now. I like the, it. I'm the, not mad. That's like when they did, uh... What I ain't gonna... Bro, we may have to crank that bitch up tonight, though, or something. Like Modern Warfare 2, what was it when they did, like... I'm ready to see what that bitch... I'm ready to see what that bitch vowed. I hate it, bro. I'm just saying... Rust was hard. Hey, can you land down. a nigga a pencil? Uh, no, 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 no. See, that, 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 that's not it, Portia. It's, can you, can a nigga borrow a french fry? Like, nigga, how are you gonna buy a french fry? You gonna give it back? Like, I swear I didn't start talking like this before he came into my class, but see, you got you gotta hit that shit. You got, fuck the pencil. It's about the french fry. Uh, he said, that's not even the worst part. He said, the other day at lunch, can a nigga borrow a french fry? <laughs> the first thing was it, oh my god, he said the n word. It was, he was a nigga borrow a french fry. <laughs> nigga, it's and then he got it back. <laughs> like, bro, he was breaking that shit down, bro. He was, -da -da, da -da -da. He, he was breaking that shit down. Like this before he got into my class. Like, bro, he started holding up cue cards and shit, breaking that bitch down and everything. Like, bro, it's the fucking science to this shit. <laughs> this nigga, like, to for this. real, like. Yeah, he did it to me. <laughs> There's so much good shit going on in the world of crazy shit, might I say, that I would love for Boondocks to come out with another season. That's the thing. That's what makes Boondocks great, though. It's like a Busta Rhymes album. You the release some shit, ahead of his time, and then you gotta wait three, four years to let shit happen. To give you material, yeah. and that I think that's the downfall in The Simpsons and for South Park too, on the, in a sense, because a lot of people don't like South, South Park. Park. Uh, South Park. Uh, Sometimes now South Park will do some shit too early. I've been saying South Park, they don't miss a lot. Oh shit! Oh. But they the do. They miss a few times just for the simple fact 
that they produce shit so quickly. You know what I'm saying? But so yeah. saying I feel like they have dry spells and run out of shit to do or say no. when when there's not a lot of popular shit going on. Yeah, yeah no, that, yeah, that's what I'm saying. But yeah, what, yeah. but so, what they do, but what they do is though, is the thing is, is when they do that, South Park has always been one of those shows where they're not gonna tell you what they talking about. It's not like what you seeing on TV <laughs> isn't always necessarily what it is. Like sometimes you gotta read into that shit. So the first go around, you'll be like, "Oh, what the fuck is this? what the fuck is this?" Like What's when a we, fish stick? No, like when we was watching the like when we was watching the one when they was hearing the fucking Damn, uh, shit. When, when Stan started getting all cynical and shit, and everything started sounding oh, like yeah. shit in his ears. If you was to play that shit right now, whether it be females, probably some dudes or even over, they'd be like, what "The fuck is this stupid ass shit?" Yeah. <laughs> like what the fuck? They're just they're like crapping it. they be like, "What the?" They'll be just sitting there downplaying it, ridiculing like, it. But that's if, not funny. That's not this. But that's if you not sit, humor. but if you sit back and you take. It, on an intellectual thing, it's like no, they really making a lot of fucking sense. They making points on what they on what they saying. So whenever they can't, I feel like whenever they can't go on current events or whatever, then now it's like okay, now it's time to roast society real quick. Yeah. Five <laughs> dumb shit to try like, yeah, They stress their right real. legs and they get real meta on what they talk about. The and fact think, that they got a okay, black okay, reporter okay, yeah, to yeah. cover the story. Yeah, and I think I think uh, the Simpsons I, they flaw one for being on for so long. You just, they, it just gets dry no on breaks. Yeah, breaks. no break, no nothing. South, as, hey, South Park got on that too. Yeah. And at some point you Simpsons get to, did it. Simpsons yeah. did it. It's like the shit gets bored as fuck because they done done every fucking thing. Is like, there any more Family Guy coming out? Yeah, yes. new every week. And bro, honestly, I feel like Family, family Guy, fa- no, but I feel like family got, family Guy though, we, we hurt ourselves with that. We hurt <laughs> ourselves with Family Guy because Family Guy was so hot and so fucking trendy, bro, yeah. that we ran that frame out. You know what I'm saying? That, if, that if we just got freaking bored with it and shit. Like, man, what the fuck is this? But if you still go, bro, I've sat down and still watch some of the nah, new family. It's still solid. The shit is still fucking Cause, funny. Cause when I catch the yeah. clip, like when people drop new yeah. clips or some shit that come out, you know how in the internet be. And I just see some shit, I'm like, ooh, yeah, nah. That, that's cold, right? You know what I'm saying? Because you know they get mad and shit too. So Thanks for those cups, AJS. Every time you got Stewie and Brian, bro, it's, it's a fucking movie. Because it's old, Brian. Because it's old. <laughs> <laughs> No, Archie, we were just talking about that shit. We this were just talking about that shit. With my money, Brian. With my money, huh? With my money, huh? Huh? My, you can buy that fake man's stash, but you can't got my money. You, you got some Bow! Get some strawberry. On that ass. ass. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> oh, that cool cool shit. Yeah. Bro, Cool Whip and Rui. Okay, it's Rui. He said one was an it's ancient Rui. artifact. He was like, a ruin. Now say ruin. Rui. <laughs> <laughs> he said, he said, he said, he said, he said, what he said, 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 Say, like, say, we, I really feel bad because I gave up that show. Like I willingly had to give that show up. But Why? that's because that's the best show that you give you give away in breaks. So now when you go back to it, but no, I, I legitimately put that shit down and never picked it back up. It was my kids. Like, that was my one show that I was all like, I'd be damn. That's the beginning of parenting. Mm-hmm. So I was all like, you know, I'd be damn. My I'd be watching this and my kids think it's okay for them to talk to me like that. And I flop the handle. Wow, motherfucker, who do you think you are trying to act like Stewie? So, you, like, you, you know, right? I think, I think, I think my, my, my hey, pop, but that seems like, so like, contradictory like, coming from Kevin, though, just because of the way you be you talking talk around your house and the way you be way gaming you and shit. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you done watched Deadpool about four times already <laughs> up in that kids, bitch. Nigga. I know, okay, and so shit. I actually took so, so, to see Deadpool too. <laughs> but I'm saying, he's the Corby Davidson of DTKA. <laughs> no, but I'm saying as in, like, I don't know, it was just. I, Type every, with the life, po up. Touch on so much different shit. Welcome I, back, Bradley. I agree, cause my uh, my pops was similar to that too. He was big on ratings, so if that bitch was TV thirteen. You not watching that bitch TV thirteen? If it's rated no, R, no, 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 no. no hear me out. That's what, what I'm saying is, is that I get cutting it off. He didn't watch it around us, but say if he was like, if he was watching that bitch, hey. Go out, and then if we caught something that we wasn't supposed to hear, he like, hey, sit down, let me explain something to you real quick. And then I ain't got like, time for all that. I ain't got time to censor myself. No, you ain't censoring no, no, yourself. No, 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 that's what I'm saying. I'm still censoring myself. If I gotta say, hey, you can't come in here right now, then I'm watching something. Or yeah, Vin Diesel with a hot pocket, but no family guy. <laughs> Portia like, yo, <laughs> make it make sense. Ah, uh, damn it. Yeah, she got you there. She did. <laughs> Nah, I, but I I, yeah, I but do agree. With, I do agree with like, what you're saying. Cause I I, 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 I think I that's really, where explaining really, really comes in. It. But then you said you don't have time for that, and if you don't feel like explaining shit, then hey, that's your parenting style, motherfucker. Do you, motherfucker so you old say. enough to understand? You can't watch this shit. Like you said, the kids don't know. 
but we know. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Chris, what are you doing? Oh, he's rushing. Drag it down. Over here. He's like, I got, well, I got my mail as well. I just called him to see if the paperboy is okay. Hey, Chris, are you okay? I, I see haven't seen the paperboy in a while. God damn it, Chris, I ain't got my newspapers in two weeks. Where the fuck you been? That's the funniest shit. Get your fat ass back here. You fat son of a bitch. I got something in the basement for you. Nah, I got something in I got some pop shit for you. I used to see that bitch in the middle of class. When class got super dead quiet, I'm just sitting there. Everybody working on their shit. I say, I got some pop shit for you. Tyke say, nah, my kids shit. know what's for kids and what's not. I'm not pausing shit. He said, nah. If kids. I'm watching Family Guy, <coughs> my daughter won't have to have I ain't gonna lie. <coughs> They watching that shit with me. You hear me? Well, I mean, okay, so for instance, now. I don't know where Maya found it at, but she be sending me that, clips and shit. And my daughter's too. I'll so be like, what the fuck is this shit? No, that's one of those things I put down, but I just never pick back this up. Is, this is my kid right and here. My Bro, kids would you let your kids watch Rick and Morty? Ooh, that's yeah. the question. Then what the fuck won't oh. you let them watch Family Guy? What's the difference? Family Guy's way more. Way. Bro, whoa, what the huh? fuck? What? Yeah, yeah, nah, you were finished. Um, yeah, 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 I'm about to say, go ahead. Go ahead. Go, ahead. go ahead. How is Family Guy not worth They, they, they the same, morning? nigga. They are the nah, same. Nigga, they go what? to a planet full of, like, Orgy. testicles. Like, that was, yeah, testicles. Yeah, ball testicles. Testicles, bro. Places, and he talks about all types, all of, types shit. of shit, dog. You tripping. I can get you if you would have said Simpsons, because Simpsons ain't Okay, as, you know what? I'm thinking from the back of the day when I said I, I stopped watching to now. Where I'm at now with my kids. Yeah. So that's why I'm all like, yeah, I'll let them watch. Yeah, because you let them watch because, Family no, Guy because, now too, motherfucker. Probably, <laughs> but it's never been. Uh, God damn. Yeah, he's like, you got me. <laughs> but do you, anime Bradley say, but do you let your kids watch SpongeBob? I was gonna say, honestly, I think SpongeBob worse than them because other shit gonna teach you something. I, I, At least Family Guy gonna teach you something. My, my baby can watch SpongeBob. I was a SpongeBob man. I ain't gonna care. I was not. I hated, I hated SpongeBob. They can watch SpongeBob up until 2008. Still no. They can watch, uh, they can watch the old series, but after that, SpongeBob just turned dark. <laughs> and and motherfucker say, all you get to see is we'll bring it around, around time. Crusty Krabby exactly. pizza is the pizza for you and me. That you only getting the hits around oh, here. You, you, you only getting the hits. Out. My okay. older sister was watching. You say, would y'all let yeah, them bro. watch South Park? Actually, I'll... Hell no, still, bro. We had all that. That's the one I for sure. When I grew up, that's going to teach the niggas how to talk. That's going to teach my kids how to talk, and I'm good. But see, but when you get... When your kid's at the age that my daughter is right there, they already know how to. Oh, uh, no, nah, nah, nah. You know what I'm saying? Nah, yeah, my, exactly. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Like, not... Like, I'm sorry. Like, you not about... Because I mean, y'all know me. I'm real big on, like, as far as when it comes to music now and, like, the passes that we giving on music that they letting slide through. So... Who, let, who slide through? I don't let my kids slide with their music. No, I'm talk, but I'm talking about... So but, 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 yeah, but, like, the radio and I the... I had the radio change over the years and shit. You, oh, yeah. you know how that shit go. They, like, they it's say just, ass and shit now. They, don't, they ain't never used to say this shit with me. They believe all them words. The fact, say, that, the fact that WAP was a single, bro... on the radio. But the fact that WAP was a single, though, bro... They don't. They only blur out, like, half of nigga, bro. They do say that shit. But like you said, the fact that WAP was a single. Now, granted, that was some nasty ass Bruh. single. Like, Break that dick. Oh, that ski, pussy. ski. Bro, but at the same time, that was all kind of innuendoed up because you had Bootsy Collins talking I, about coming on a bitch Collins and I'd rather be with you. Because honestly, like, nobody knew it that is not. It was not. Because we didn't. As, as, you don't know that's not as. In, bro, it's, while it sounds like that, that is not as in your face as, as that song pussy, was. Nigga. To the window, to the wall. wall. To the, to the sweat drop down, down, down my balls. balls. No, but to the sweat drop down my what? Oh, this, 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 this. what? Oh, they did. They actually played it off, nigga. We, they, why the fuck you? Why do you bleep song? crawl? Because say bitches. But that's how they do. It. But because I'm fucked up. <laughs> but that's how they did the. No, this is what I'm saying. That's how they did the shit. Now it's wake up for that. Huh, I mean, stroking. E. Exactly. They literally say no, no, C. No. They say C. They say like they just blur out the first part of the word. Like they say nigga. They just blur out the nuh. Then they guh. Or they just say the guh. They just blur out the guh and they don't blur out the nigga. And then eighty percent of the song be fucking bleep outs because they can't fucking say half the shit. Cause you you know ninety seven nine and K one four bleep different. That problem missed me because <laughs> okay. yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. listen to the radio. I'm trying to figure out what that nah because it but was that, it was one funny ass phrase when I heard WAP on the radio, fam. It was it was they had a whole phrase but it wasn't wet. I forgot what it was. That shit threw me off. I was like, what? Oh, yeah, no, they did have something else for the that bitch. The fuck did she just say? That's like how they did Big Energy. Got that big, big 
energy. Yeah. I was like, <laughs> man, I mean, like, it makes sense, but at the same time, y'all. I can, no, I can see funny. them. Th- I see, nah, that what they did on there. I can see them doing the wop. What they would do when they would when, when like basic cable with censor shit, rated yeah. R movie and shit. Yeah, no, nah, like, like, like that. We would call that shit wet ass cookie. Right, be like, like, wait, what? Like some other yeah, be like, be like, wait, what? Huh? Some nah, that ain't cookie. it. Oh, yeah. Is that, exactly some shit that'll make you be like, hold on, wait, uh, uh-uh, uh, uh. What you uh-uh. did about shit in milk, bitch? Uh, yeah, man, it should be like, like real. Shit, you know what I'm saying? Most most of the time, I can't even get the cookie to fit in the fucking cup. Never mind. <laughs> uh, ah, I get it. I'm gonna use that. I'm gonna use that as a fucking metaphor, motherfucker. That's hard. Bars. <laughs> Cyberpunk, the biggest flop. Okay, look. So. Pull up. I, especially after playing it and beating it the other day. Damn, and Bradley, you right. Yeah. Uh, why the fuck did I have to do that? That's not what I really want that for. They, um. No. God damn it, that's the wrong little slot. I think I want to say it's, it's about their multiplayer. Uh, I'm terrible at my shit. He should have gave me like a heads up. Cyberpunk 2077's oh, multiplayer mode was canceled following its turbulent launch. And we all know that. We all, like, you know what I'm saying? But I think that's the biggest flop that they could have done for that game because they could have turned that into some GTA 5 online shit. That shit could have easily went so fucking deep to where you I wouldn't even... have failed. I wouldn't have failed. I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have gotten rid of it because yeah. y'all, like, honestly, I'm, I'm, high, I'm happy that we're getting the uh, Witcher update next week. Stay sipping because we're going to be streaming that. I already got that shit down. Uh... Fucking uh, you could have been keeping that team dedicated to See, that to that shit this whole the time. They could have been working yeah, exa- the whole time. Exactly, exactly. So like, and we was looking. I was looking no forward to that. I was looking bro, forward that to that. Been so lit because after playing it, bro, in the world, and I still ain't explored every part of that world. You know what I'm saying? And it's like all the bugs and glitches that niggas talk about. I'm almost positive that's only on PC. Almost positive because I played that bitch. That's next gen. Quissy just Quissy just kids Bob. Uh, wop for us, bro. What is Waffle and pancake. Uh-huh. <laughs> we taking wop, 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 wop. Hey, well, pancake. they told my granny. Boy, they told my granny wop meant worship and praise. She almost went to church saying that shit. I had to tell her, boy. She went in there and cussed my sister. <laughs> she moved the fuck out. Uh, Why damn. would you tell me wop meant worship and praise? No, all the finna I thought it was waiver of premium. <laughs> <laughs> so granny granny came in there. Play that wop. Play that wop. <laughs> oh, God. They talking about granny. That's Granny started hitting them Snoop Dogg straight. I got that worship. What? I got that worship, 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 worship and praise. I got that worship, 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 worship and praise. Uh, That's a terrible remix. I ain't even explored it all, Uh but I'm almost positive that all the little bugs and shit got to go to the PC because that's next gen, right? Yeah. I played that bitch on next gen. For sure. And y'all watch me play that bitch. And even in that first stream where I thought that they didn't give me my motherfucking gift, they did. I just didn't know how to fucking find that bitch in the store. So they didn't, like, all the little glitches. Yeah, they had little small glitches. Somebody clipping through a light pole. Somebody jumping off of some shit when you do But all games have them hoes. And personally, if a game don't have that bitch, I'm not going to like the game. That bitch better make me laugh because the car just did some 360s because all I did was shoot it one time. Like, I need to see that shit. That's a video game to me, bitch. The, the game needs to have bugs. Shit's not perfect. You motherfuckers want a movie. Go watch a fucking movie what then, the nigga. What the fuck is this nigga talking about? What I mean is... Minor, you want to pay full money for a minor, fucking buggy-ass game? I didn't say buggy. I said a game should have some minor little bugs and shit, and it makes it fun. If you don't agree with me, bro, then I'm sorry, but if you can't tell me you ain't ran into the fucking glitch on some shit... There ain't not like one game shit. that's released that has been bug-free. Not one. There's not none. There's not a game that's right, been released Right, but you're saying for me to free. find it fun? I find certain bugs fun as hell. I, I'm, I, sh- I'm trying to think of the last game that I played where I can remember where a bug in the game that I exploited for fun. Call of Duty Zombies World at War? Black Ops 2. No, Black Ops 1. Zombies. No. You didn't, you, none of those Easter eggs and achievements and stuff that you got to get shit going with shooting the teddy bears and getting the shit to pop off and like that. You those were glitches. Those were glitches. Initially. That's exactly how that shit popped off. That's, that's, initially, that's exactly how that's exactly how that's exactly, exactly, that's exactly how okay, that shit okay, popped off. Okay, okay, I'm confused now. What are you talking about? The Easter eggs and shit the, the that shit came that a big staple for zombies. For zombies, yes. nah, a lot those of those were glitches. glitches. A lot of those were glitches that game, game bugs and shit that nigga found. Like, if you shoot something so many times, they weren't Easter eggs initially. They turned into Easter eggs. Oh, Easter then, no, eggs I, never, I, never, I never did that in the beginning. I only did it 
when YouTube had videos of this is it no on where oh no on oh, world oh, 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 world at war because this is how because this shit hey Fabio with the oh hold up hold up we got another new one we got a like we got Fabio with the like and then we got a new sipper Angelus pulling up y'all I need no cups up in that chat right now for our new sipper pull the hell up. What the fuck was I talking about? He's get glitchy games. I think mm -hmm. you were talking about the Modern Warfare. Yeah, but in general, in general though, what I mean is like when you doing certain shit, I can't. It's hard for me to think on the spot, and I should look some of them up. But when you playing like say a fucking Crash Bandicoot game or some shit, and you find some shit that yeah, it's not supposed to go like that. But God damn it, that shit was funny as hell. Oh yeah, because them fucking YouTube video, them YouTube videos were uh, up, and that's how we was finding them shit. Mm -hmm. Because every time we turn that bitch on, I remember getting tired of hearing motherfuckers say, Hey, you wanna know about this new glitch I got? Hey, you wanna try this glitch? Hey, you wanna try this glitch? Like, bro, <laughs> I'm just trying to fucking play the game. If you come up in this bitch and say glitch one more time, I'm reporting your shit ten times, nigga. Like, coming up in here talking about glitch, 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 so, glitch, so glitch, no. glitch, shit. Oh, okay, you know what? You know what? I lie. It's probably a Call of Duty Modern Warfare glitch to get on top. No, it's probably Halo. Halo had hello them bitches. Halo had, Halo had hella exploits. Actually, now that you think about it, you're right. Where you can clip outside the map, be on top of some shit, and do some extra shit. So, the thing is... Halo. Now, yes, two... Porsche pulled them up. Where the rest of y'all fucking cups at? Quincy, you up in here talking shit and all of that, but you can't welcome our new sipper and all that good shit. Hey, I'm about to get in y'all... Hey, y'all. I, I better get some... I better get some more. Quincy. I better... We be in here roasting Portia about these raisins and stuff like that, and she quick to pull up her cups and stuff. Hey, I need the rest of y'all pulling up those cups for our new sipper who just got up in here rocking with us. But pull like, them cups up. I don't want the game to be super fucking buggy to where I can't do shit. What do I call a book club that's been on the same book for years? Yo mama. Church. Pull them fucking cups up. Damn it for our new sipper. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but, uh, I do like a Tony Hawk game where... I run into some shit, or I can find a back wall or some shit, and I can just, it's random. And it's like, oh, There oh, we shit. go. This shit's now I'm cool. happy. But my biggest one is like, when I like, if I shoot something, and the ragdoll animation ain't normal. It, they don't just immediately fall how it's supposed to naturally do, and they do some, woo, shit, they jump up Some shit, shit you will see on GTA every now and then. I like that shit. I want some wild shit. Like, Saints Row have actual little cheats that you can put big head mode, zero gravity mode. I don't mind those sometimes slipping into the cracks of a game that I'm playing through. It's like, damn, I just shot him. He flew into the air for no reason. Nobody else did it. Just that one character. I'm going to laugh at that. I'm not going to be like, this game right. fucking sucks. No, it this... doesn't deserve my $60. Now, I'm not saying that's what you're saying. Right. But when you look at the fucking, what people do when they give reviews, me. that's how they fucking talked about Cyberpunk. These niggas don't even walk on the stairs. They're just sliding up and then clipping through. Fam, you don't even interact with the NPCs. What the fuck are you crying And that's for? just one motherfucker in the apartment, so you ain't never gonna fucking interact like, with ever. Like, what the ever. fuck? That shit's stupid. So it's Keep like, it moving. I, I, like, for them to cancel the whole multiplayer shit and all the potential they had with that universe and game modes and shit that they could have did, they could have easily made Rockstar have to <coughs> fuck. It's not, but they could have easily... Their fault. Very much so. They used to get in the house. But it's also beat. our fault. Nope. No, it is. We didn't put out the game. We but didn't give a, a We bitched date. about it too early. And I firmly think that's the issue. I think that people ranking and, and, and what's the what's the shit? Review bombing? Is that that's Yes, the bro, because because it. now bro, people are so everybody, bro, everybody wants to blow up and shit. So Be you even crazy. see so you go up on here, you'll see shit on YouTube. Where people will be quick to do a damn video to rag on some shit because, bro, like it or not, and we've talked about this on the podcast before, bro, society fucking loves negativity. A motherfucker is gonna click on a negative video before they click on a positive video. You know what I'm saying? So, especially with something that's being anticipated and folks ragging on it, that's exactly what they gonna do. And folks will do that shit, hey, before they even really give it a chance. And Cyberpunk got oh, ragged on way oh, too early. Shit. You know what I'm saying? Because when that game came out, it was me and a few other people sitting around like, I don't even know what bugs y'all talking about. Oh, like, shit. we yeah. playing this shit just fine. You we know what a, I'm saying? We had a good but, stream these past couple games. Man, my nigga, this my nigga, bro. Me and Sonic, we done got real cool these past couple, past couple weeks. All right, bro, this my nigga right now. You know what I'm saying? He like Chucky right now. Bro, I'm yeah. saying he's official, bro. <laughs> he's a, he's <laughs> official, bro. He's official. Sonic is official. He say, I like slipping in cracks too. Bradley, you are hell. For that one right there. I see what you did there. 
Hey, real quick, let's see if y'all sippers done pulled up any questions or topics that y'all like us to talk about real quick. Let's see here. Uh, Jeff says, Umaga's son beginning wrestling training. I'll only bring this one up. I know we normally say that for Thursday, but since I'm not going to be doing a speaking of this Thursday, I'll answer this one. And we all know Umaga. It's a whole lot of them. It's like they got this shit planned out like, hey, we're going to have our kids here, 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 and here. So once this, this one happened, the next one rolling. It's like every year you look up, there's a new Fatu or a new Samoan coming up through the fucking ranks. And I rock with it. Hey, do your motherfucking thing. Uh, how sexy Rhea Ripley is, 1 to 10. Uh, I'd give I'd give about a, I'd give about a 8 and a half, 9. I was going to say, depending on my mood. Angelus dropped in said the last of us second trailer pull up okay that, that, let's, talk now, about it. let's talk already, about it let's talk about it let's talk about but a sipper a sipper want us to talk about it. Hey, this is a new sipper who ain't heard us talk same, about it the same way we did house of dragon trust uh last of last us of last of us i told game. you yes sir so you, you a playstation nigga you have no excuses Man. no no excuses no weakness. I still ain't really played it. I, I, I'll be watching videos of it, though. I played the first I one. I ain't played it. No, I'm talking about the series. So when the series coming out, huh? as, as the person that's watched the first one, when we talking about it, you're going to be our, what's the word, our, our canon gonna, ter- person. You tell be, us what, what the detail person. Yeah, you're going like, to be, be our, you gonna be our source. You're going to no, be our source material. Off, you go off memories, but if you want to go play it again for it. I can't go off memories. because All I can remember was that I played the game, the first, the first one. I put on the hardest difficulty. And I got fucking stuck on the stage in a fucking gymnasium for like <laughs> five months, bro. He's a completionist and a quitter at the same time. And it's hilarious to me. You feel us, Carly? Quitter and a spitter. Nigga, I was, what the fuck? Oh, no, <laughs> Damn. Uh, and I'm talking about, nigga, I was eventually, I caved in and turned the, turned the difficulty down. And I was mad as fuck. Because it was a whole different game. Yeah, when difficulty Man, changed. nigga, I was finding shit in cabinets. I had rashes. And see, today. and that's why, and that's why when there are certain games, for instance, games like that and Resident Evil and things like that, I don't jump into those games right out the gate on hard. Neither on Fallout. Those you gotta jump in on normal. And you know what I'm saying? Get the lay of it. See how things work. I ain't no so punk, then when bitch. you nigga, j- jump in and play Fallout on survival if you want to. Oh, I ran out of water a couple times and mm-hmm. died. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, they end that bitch struggling for real. But once you play the best and you actually know how to go and maneuver shit, it's a whole lot easier to play. Now, if you want fucking Far Cry or some shit like that, oh, nah, yeah, we can we can crank that bitch up. Like, let's go. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's nigga, just what that is. Have you played Spider-Man on the hardest difficulty? Hell yeah, that's the only way I played that bitch. Nigga, you that's, that's, that's the only way to play that bitch. You got me, he was here. I played nigga, that's the only way to play that bitch. You got me, he was here. I played that bitch. You got me, he was here. I played that bitch. Whatever the fuck that last one is, nigga, yeah. The last one they give you, because I know there's another one that you get after you beat it. Yeah, you got to get, that's that's the one I'm talking about. That's, that nigga got super, super, super hard, bitch. That's yeah, like the, legendary. Yeah, nigga, I started on hard. Nigga, I ain't playing all so hard. We played the hardest. You you he's, a, he's talking about turning on 2K and turning that bitch straight to Hall of Fame. Like, nah, <laughs> nigga, fuck, exactly. Nigga. We don't play all mad, nigga. We play all pro. What fuck you talking about? <laughs> 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 all pros, they don't be cheating and shit. Fuck you. <laughs> Speaking of, hey, I want y'all to sip with us. I want y'all to sip with us uh, real quick, y'all. Don't go nowhere because we got some interesting takes on this, I believe. You brought this up on how to revamp sports. Oh, I saw this chick post this shit. And <coughs> initially, <coughs> niggas may not like this shit. Okay. But anybody with a girl, which everybody has probably had to sit through one of them fucking chick shows before. Yeah. Hear me out. Chick shows. Hear me out. Oh. Lifetime movie network. <laughs> nah, no, no, I'm talking about reality TV. Oh, okay. shit. Yeah. Bad girl. I've been forced shit. to watch some football recently, and I really think they should consider editing the matches to have confessionals from the players like in reality TV shows. Would be way more interesting. Nigga, if that ain't the best idea in the fucking world, I don't know how to tell you. I don't need football live no more. Nigga, run that bitch and then have these niggas. Then somebody was At like, this moment. Then they was like, Last of Us 2 will be on said, HBO oh, Max, Portia. I seen the open. No, nah, but I look, took off. I they was 40 like, yards. There's, there's. There was post game interview. Nah, fuck that nigga. I want to see. <laughs> Damn, I said, hut. That, see, when we started this playoffs, I thought it was going to go all right. I didn't think Burfick was going to come in as fast and knock the shit out of me. Then go back to the play. Hut. 
I was so much. I was. I was so much watched. Or if you don't want to spoil, if you don't want to spoil the play, if you don't want to spoil the play, had it run the play, and then after the play, go immediately to confessionals of whoever got their ass smacked, and it's like, look, man, that shit hurt like a bitch. Like, nigga, that shit would be funny as hell, bro. But how would you be able to do that in football? Not live no more. No more live sports. But you know who the motherfuckers at the game is gonna sneak it and tell Man. you what the fuck you already gonna know who's gonna lose by what? Who bro? gives a fuck? I wanna see confessionals now, bitch. It's a confessional ass. <laughs> I wanna see that nigga. If Aaron you can Rodgers run hard say. knocks at the same damn time, I can have my real football going on and then I can have just like they do NFL follies or some shit. We can have them said that shit fucking you know switched saying? over to that fucking like, format. It ain't, I, it ain't shit. Gonna lie, though. Okay, and, and okay. No, 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 I, I got a copy. That's what commentators are. Let me get this one out. Let me get this one. Hold on. It would be nice minutes. though, because they always show us the motherfucking fights that happen, and it'd be really kind of cool to see. Hey man, that motherfucker talk shit about my grandma. And like, like, like bro, I'm telling you. <laughs> he's like, you know, he's like, I it ain't gonna say. Like, yeah, I knew it was a bad idea. Like, no, motherfucker. Why did I swing at him with his fucking helmet on? <laughs> <laughs> like, I, I know this motherfucker. Like, I got bare knuckles. This motherfucker got a helmet yeah, on. Man. I ain't got my head. He got a helmet I got three fucking stitches. I I'm Jason Pierre-Paul in this bitch. Fucked uh-huh. up. I could have just took it off and swung it, but no. My compromise. You could hear this shit. And that's what I'm saying. So that's my compromise shit. would be. Motherfucker lit me up in front of my kids, do, bro. You, would, you wouldn't do this live. But this is how you would show every playback so you know how they be running shit from back january in the day 15th yo i'm that rocking with angelis over here interactive and shit right. pull up instead of just giving us the live game when they do reruns they would have this okay shit. cool that, i'll that's take my, that that's my compromise for it because I, I get a lot football, live football no nfl game. tv you know when they play the old games or whatever you give me the whole nigga game. they could do that now nigga they could have them old niggas go back and just record confessionals for that shit they could rewatch the play and be like damn when you hit me right there, I ain't gonna lie, I didn't think I was getting up. Like, that shit was really... Bettis? Yeah, bro. They was like, see, they thought I was coming off because I was injured. I couldn't breathe. Like, that shit would be lit as fuck. <laughs> the sideline, because, see, they already do it, because they already somewhat yeah, do it yeah, whenever yeah. they do, like, NFL films or something like that, and they actually, see, not like, not when they're doing the see, player profiles, but when they cover in the, when they cover in the team, yeah. they did, 30, they did. Called. They did one on the Bills, well, there's 30 for 30, and then there's the NFL football life on NFL Network. They'll do one where, nigga, they had uh, two of the players sitting down on a couch at one of their cribs and was, like, watching their game and shit, and they was talking shit, you know what I'm saying, like, throughout the movie. And they kind of go back and forth to it, but the commentary was there, though. Oh, you're talking about what was Tom Brady. Uh, it was Tom Brady. Nah, it was the one on the night. It was the one. Nah, it was the one. Nah, it was the one on the Buffalo Bills going over the uh, the times they went to the football for, uh, Super Bowl four times oh, okay. and didn't make it. And win shit. They did win a damn thing. You know why, right? <laughs> hey, look, you're not smoking, it ain't even gonna work, fam. Because I'm gonna eye out that shit for <laughs> Open that door. I'm sitting here like, I can't even breathe. I'm trying to. <laughs> but nah, but real shit, because I know y'all sip, I know y'all sippers don't, you know what I'm saying, we ain't gonna stay on sports too, too low, you know what I'm saying, too low, because I know y'all wanna get to some more ish. Uh, here's y'all, you wanna talk about a billion dollar idea? I got another one for you. And if y'all ever, if y'all hear this anywhere else, they stole that shit from here. You heard this shit here first. Here's what I think they should do. Erase the freaking Pro Bowl. Get rid of the Pro Bowl. Fuck that Pro Bowl shit. Fuck that Pro Bowl shit. Erase it. And I'm going to tell you why. Number one, you already got people who don't want to go to the Pro Bowl because of injuries and shit. So the game's already watered down. You know what I'm saying? Because people focused on playoffs and playing the regular season. So the Pro Bowl ain't even what it used to be. Then what you do (laughs) Once you do that, immortalize Madden. Oh, turn it into the not nah, turn not nah, turn it into nah, turn it into now. Nah, I want to make sure I get my now. Nah, I want to get my words right. I want to get my words okay. right. Make sure like t- instead of it being the Pro Bowl, since you just gonna be selecting people, you can still select people like you did the Pro Bowl, but to where you ain't gotta worry about them going and playing a game. Just turn that shit into the All Madden team. You know what I'm saying? Like how they used to have the All Madden doing. team back in the day. We talking about doing that. But are they turning into all Madden team? Like, I draft the team, you draft the team. No, 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 no remember, fuck that. So remember Madden 04, let's go to that. You hit R1 on the motherfucking thing a couple times, you can get the O2 team, O4 team. Or what like playing with the East got, All-Stars or the West All-Stars in all basketball. Madden. Then you got all Madden, which is the best all people. Every year you do that. So you got twenty the, the all Madden 22 uh, team. 
the all Madden 23 team. So now it's so now so now it's like so now it's like you're getting selected Amen. to the Pro Bowl or what used to be the Pro Bowl, but you ain't got to go worry about doing that game. You still get those bonuses as far as, like, getting they, the pay and stuff like that, but now we ain't got to worry about well, they, this they, fucking game with a bunch of fucking play, like, bro. Ain't that what they did, though? They don't, they don't really play games. The, the game no more, they do all the mini games and shit like that. Like the, no, they still no but the they're game also all of they're, 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 oh, they're having okay, a Madden okay. tournament. And so, no, nah, but see, I see what he's saying, and I agree but with I you, see, too. No, nah, it's both. It's both. What it is is you do the picks, to immortalize niggas as all pro. You know what I'm saying? Because that's what you deserve that shit. I right. fucks with the pro, bro. And I do too, but what he's saying is that a lot of them don't even really like playing. That's why you get fucking 99 to 99 because the niggas just fuck it be, it be second, it be second, second, It be second and third string people who be going and playing the game who don't even really so be all pro so, players. So but it's not even, no, you so know what I'm saying? So These you, niggas don't even be out there playing for real, bro. It's a game. So then just, so then put on the game and just let the people who want to go, go. Right, shit, nah, and then just, just, so just, just put on a game celebrating during that time. So even Talk though, shit, let yeah, everybody, even just, yeah, just let like If you want to play, if you want to play, go. Because you could possibly get a better, you know what I'm saying? Do what's good for the section, game, right? You could probably get better on the roster section if you nah, show, if you show out. Against that, you know what I'm saying? Whatever. And then, but I one, do think the Pro Bowl, like the pre games and shit. Nah, I that, that shit lit. Because niggas ain't getting hurt in that shit. Niggas ain't getting hurt. They ain't getting hurt in that, but it show who, who better. It show competitive. No, no, no. Yeah, because like with the, because uh, I think the quarterback got one where they throw him through like those different. Yeah. I forgot okay, what the fuck. Hey, was burn, 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 burn. He already. And since this what I'm saying, this motherfucker official. This motherfucker's official. Whoever Angelis Noel is, this motherfucker's official. I like this motherfucker right here. Pull up. Uh, okay, so we got that's that. My slogan. Yeah. <laughs> bro, this, this what, bro, we, you know what I'm saying? We rock around here. <laughs> now, last last <laughs> thing before we keep, last thing before we keep it pulled up. This is a dope fucking visual. This shit looks so fucking amazing. Uh, Deion Sanders, pull up. Okay. So, if you ain't heard, Deion Sanders, no more Deion Sanders is preparing to take the head coaching job at Colorado having spent the past week recruiting staff recruiting staff and players to the school, sources tell. He is expected to leave Jackson State following the SWAC title game this year. Yep. And people are on his ass. No. He did what he did. There's two things. No, nope, there's two. I'll give you two. A reason why I knew he was going to leave. Day one, I knew this nigga was going to leave. He never said I mean, he no, was staying. No, he never did. No. But just in general, day one, I knew that nigga wasn't going to be there for a long time. We had that press conference... All my shit was stolen out of my office. Oh, oh yeah. Nah, I was right. like, that nigga ain't gonna be there long. Nah, yeah, you're right. I remember that shit. But not even just that, bro. Like, as much as he is in, like, we can, is, he did what he said he was gonna do, and that was bring the attention two? to, you know what I'm saying, to a respect. Hold on. I'm saying, even two, yeah. go ahead. you got, yeah. he kept asking for help. We did the locker rooms. These kids ain't eating right. He, he got all that shit, though. That's His it. old buddy, he was asking for help from the boosters and nobody wants to fucking help him. It's okay, I'll do it. I'll pay for it. But fucking, how am I going to help y'all? Y'all don't want to help me. Oh, <laughs> so look, let's just, I'm on the internet. Now it's the picture. Deion Sanders and Brett Favre. One made money for Mississippi. One took money from Mississippi. Guess which one black people are relentlessly talking about? Guess. The dead. one that made money for their ass. They ain't talking about the one that took the money. And we do I, ourselves there, bro. We I, so quick to fucking talk shit, dog. And my biggest, my biggest thing that I don't think people. It's easy to fucking be a hate ass yeah, nigga, yeah, dog. Yeah, it's like, so many, it's so many people. I think there was a minister dude that done went. He don't went viral because he was like, he hopes he fails because this, that, and other. And then he wants to fix it, talking about I didn't mean him to <coughs> fail personally. I wanted anything that's white supremacy to fail. And I'm sitting here like one. First of all. <coughs> fuck what y'all talking about with this HBCU shit. I don't give a fuck because college is fucking college. So whether you, if you go to HBCU and you love it, that's all fine and fucking dandy. Enjoy your fucking school, have pride. That's great. But bitch, the world ain't just black. The world is a lot more motherfucking people than just black people. So unless your ass plan on staying in a crab in a barrel ass place, get the fuck out of the hood. Get the fuck out of historically black institutions because guess what? The people that's running the company that you're trying to go work for, they went to PWI. They over there. 
Go out there, extra shit. Like, I hate the fucking term. PWI. Pre- predominantly white cop in- institution. <coughs> and I hate that fucking term. Because it's only like that because niggas don't go. And you can fucking go because I went to one. But so it's, it's like, motherfuckers want to have that mindset on shit, bro. But then, no, they want to have, but they had that mindset <laughs> where they want to go there. But then turn around and then start hating on their own fucking This and, is why I say, bro, we as black people are the most and, contradictory. And then, and contradicting it, fucking culture, and bro. And we can take it further. They talk about, I agree, well, though, I agree. He, he brought the odds to Jackson State. The odds ain't fucking going nowhere. No, they he brought two ti- go, nah, go He ahead. won two fucking titles in three years. He did that shit with them. So when he leaves, <coughs> if that shit falls, it's not fucking on him. He built the shit up. So if they can't keep the fucking shit rolling, it's not on him. Two, when a nigga goes to somewhere and actually fucking elevates, what the fuck you think he finna do? You think he only finna recruit fucking... Pl- he gonna recruit the same fucking players to that fucking school. So now, all these motherfuckers that would've never had a fucking shot to go to a PWI now have an easy fucking access. And Deion wouldn't have been Sanders going to that school. And they wouldn't have been going to your school anyway had it not been for him being there. And you now they get way more fucking eyes than Jackson State ever gonna fucking get. And let's keep, let's keep it Kool-Aid, bro. The people wanna talk about, oh, what he just did for just Jackson State. That's bullshit. Where he just by him going over there, he brought eyes to HBCU <coughs> games. Period. Because look at this. Before then, all they was doing, all they was doing on ESPN, bro, was like, you know how first Man. take, no, you know how first, you know how first take love to travel everywhere. You know what I'm saying? Where sometimes they'll come down to Dallas, sometimes they'll do first take in LA and shit like that. They'll do like uh, first take at a HBCU college or something like that, or they'll go down to like the military or some shit. shit. Right, right. They were doing that. Once Dion got down there, the motherfucker started broadcasting games. Now y'all getting y'all they're, they two games back to back on ESPN TV. So now y'all getting coverage. Everything about y'all is getting covered. Not just his and school, paid. but the and you getting paid. Not just his school, but the other teams <coughs> that's fucking or the other schools that's around this shit. He did his fucking job. But see, the thing is, is when niggas, bro, or people in general, I'm not even just gonna say black folks. Whenever most people, bro, whenever they see you coming up past them or doing something better than them, bro, the motherfuckers start hating, bro. And that's what that is. You know what I'm saying? Once he went to Colorado, once he went and took that Colorado school, they start hating on him. Oh, why he, why Dion gotta stay down here, bro? I don't get that shit. Why does he gotta fucking stay down here? Why can't he keep fucking elevate, bro? He's fucking prime time. He is not about to fucking stay. You didn't hear what he said? And he's not staying down there his whole fucking time. Nah, he said either you elevate or you die. Well, they, I mean, he's, he's been about that though. That's been his that's mindset. Been he, that's, that, like, that's always been his fucking mindset, I mean, he did bro. With Atlanta, when he left oh, Atlanta, when he left Atlanta, when he bro, to go to he had a school here, and I'm next, sit, I had to look it up to see how the shit, up. and it ended up fucking dissolving because of the yeah, it was some yeah, it was some uh, yeah, it was some fuckery, but, but yeah, that wasn't fucking him. <laughs> and even still, the shit that he was able to do for the kids that actually went and did shit, nigga got motherfuckers. They would have never got the fucking eyes if they wasn't connected to that shit. Now, because the shit didn't last, ain't got shit to do with him. He's not running every single piece of that motherfucking thing. So, uh, like, my main point, he built the shit up. If the shit falls when he leaves, it's not his fucking fault. It, it's really not. He, and he's doing exactly what he's supposed to do. Every fucking coach. Now, granted, somebody, some other black coach is supposed to step in. One. Two. He's going somewhere where we want him to go. What the fuck? Do we not want to have a seat at the... I, now, granted, coming from me, this is kind of weird. Uh-oh. But, Uh-oh. do for everybody, <coughs> for all these motherfuckers that want to be accepted, you know what I'm saying? That, that's, I think that's the best way for me to say it. For everybody that want to be accepted by the institution, isn't it best we have somebody up there that can vouch for us and get us in there as well? Because the other motherfuckers ain't going to do it. They've already showed. Dion, the only one that's showing he going to actually do some shit. So I don't see the issue of him going somewhere where he can elevate the players as well. Well, man, can't carry the whole school. That's right, Bradley. And that's the school fault of them for just sitting there trying to just bake and eat off this man and shit like that. Like, y'all want, again, y'all want him to stay there. But like Kevin said, y'all don't want to give him the fucking resources that he need and shit like that to entice him. Don't, 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 don't sit here. Don't sit here. Don't sit here. Nigga, two don't, and three Don't years, sit here bro. and think just like, because, oh, we winning. And I'm sitting here doing shit that you I'm can just do me any kind of nah, fuck away. Nigga. Nah, man, I'm going to chuck. You bet. Hey, and what? Because I, I got no. leverage. Oh, no, nigga. I, I got leverage. Like, I don't know if motherfuckers know how hard it is. But for when you a first-time coach, not a first-time coach because he a coach. But when you come to a school and you got to rebuild it yourself 
and within, <laughs> and within three years, you get two fucking titles on a school that wasn't doing shit before you got there? Man, yeah. say, that nigga can leave he if he fucking want to. Valley said he All got right, an institution. Now, I'm not going to lie. I do, <laughs> I, do, I do see the other side. I know we got kind of speeded up, but this, was, this, is, this shit is personal to me because I'm, I'm a football player. And I know how this recruiting shit go. So, as a player, if somebody going to... When 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 you get recruited, like I I, mm-hmm. I understand all the players that's decommitted from Texas State because pull up Rachel with that like and that share, stay serious. You come, and I was only coming because Dion asked. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, Bradley, you stupid. And so I can understand that aspect because I felt real close. One of my coaches, and my junior year, he had the opportunity to go to uh fucking what's the one in West Dallas, Pinkston. He was he was gonna go head coach Pinkston and shit. Now, his plan was, nigga, I'm bringing you with me. But it don't matter because in my eyes, I'm like, how the fuck you going to do that and stay with my mama? And so I'm sitting here like, bitch, you going to leave me like that? And so it's like, I understand when you develop a bond with a coach and you're like, damn, you're going to be my coach. We're going to go, 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 go. And now you just leave. So the ones that's already at JSU and he's leaving, it's like, damn, coach, you just leaving me stuck out in the dry now. So I do understand to an extent from their perspective. But when Dion's a coach, he already knows this shit is going to come. Like you said, elevation is the motherfucking goal. So if you don't, if you stay stagnant, you die. You have to learn. Shit ain't gonna go your way. See, motherfuckers that's ain't what always, he said. Yeah, motherfuckers ain't always gonna stay. He said, People gonna leave. You gotta move on and keep going. You can't let that shit destroy you and shit. And that's like, goes, colleges don't give you no tombstone. They don't bury you there. Bro, real they shit. They fire you and get you out of there. <coughs> don't die. Perfect, perfect example before we pull up. Like uh, today. My daughter was supposed to fucking... You know what I'm saying? She was supposed to go to a quad. Portia, fuck you. <laughs> she's no, she, like person. She's supposed, she supposed to go to a quad. She's supposed <laughs> to have like a, a choir uh, recital to go to. But she had to get her shit right in order to go, to, you know what I'm saying, to be able to do it. Just like how you got to keep keep your grades up and do all that shit to stay on the team and no shit. No pass, no play. So she did, she did all of that. Bitch tried her today who kept trying to bully her. And she whooped that ass. The day of the concert. And now I can't go. <laughs> Put all that work in, did all that shit, and now you can't even go. And they not going to give a fuck. But they don't care. And that's, and that's one of those lessons to where now she got that experience. Like, damn, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> even when you do everything and, you know what I'm saying, do shit the right way or whatever like that, that shit can still get taken from you. That's just, life ain't fair. You know what I'm saying? Water. But, hey. That nigga said, like, fuck about water. <laughs> what's up with this? What's up with Frito Bangs, though? Why 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 did I have yeah, to write his name down? Fredo? Do you what, Fredo? Oh, that was you? You got yeah. something on Fredo? Oh yeah. shit, hold up. Uh, what do you know about the bang <laughs> man? What you know about the bang man, Kevin? At least she so. whooped that ass. Hey, Angie. Hey, Andrew. What you know about the bang man? Gorilla guy. Uh, so, <laughs> Angie, <laughs> Andrew and Angie oh with that like pulling up with us. That's what the fuck I'm talking about. That's Stay sipping Kool Aid so good, even a diabetic yeah. could drink it. Know what I'm talking about? Like you gonna be the first one to answer. So he came out and said, "Stud pussy is top tier." Oh yeah, I saw that shit not too long ago. All right. Is he? Is, is <coughs> he said he is, stud. Yeah, stud pussy, pussy is top tier. <laughs> is he in the closet or no? I think he's joking. And the reason why? No, he. Being dead ass. I think I think he's joking because he's fucking with him. But let's go with the thing. That wasn't no Bears jersey, <laughs> Angie. That was a Ray Lewis Miami jersey. I, I figured. But let's just roll with he was serious. <laughs> and, and let's go with that. I I I I'll roll, I'll roll with that narrative. I, that's all, I think he just trolled. I'm gonna roll. <laughs> let's roll with the narrative that he was serious. Fuck it. Okay. So Portia, you the dropping the top tier. Nah. Do you agree? Nah. These niggas that fuck dykes. Pussy Me kids pussy. talk about this shit all the time. Pussy is pussy. Bitches only gay to the right nigga. Till they meet the right nigga. I didn't. <coughs> oh, right. Okay, I was like. Bitches only gay till they meet the right nigga. I, I get it. That's very close minded to me, but fuck it. <laughs> I was going to say, I'm like, uh, <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to say. I've seen a very, all I'm going to say is, very sexy dyke. They use they use dildos still, right? Ain't no cap. This is thick and everything. Ball headed like Amber Rose. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, no. Cause look, Damn, look, look. Some, some of them studs be moving around and like they're not. And her girlfriend not. was on pressure. They be moving around like they not thick as fuck. Like bitch, you thick. You ain't no nigga. Come here, like fuck. You ain't no nigga. That is a pussy between your legs. But I mean, like fucking the fucking the women that look 
have manly features. That's how, a pussy between your legs. How, 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 how stud like <laughs> are you? I ain't, I ain't fucking no chick that looks like little Boosie, like, bro. Oh, okay, so y'all are fucking with Vin Diesel go, with a hot pocket bitch. Go pick a. No, go, hold up, hold up, no, hold up. Hold up, hold up. I'm gonna get Archie right now. Hold up, hold up. I got all you niggas right now. Hold up, I'm gonna get all you niggas right now. Think of all you niggas right now. A gym bitch. See, I'm saying y'all not hitting China. No. Hold on, wait, what? Mm hmm. A, gy- a gym chick, yep. China. Oh, nah, I'm, no, I'm not discriminating against that. Mm-hmm. So, she got manly features. So, she look more like a man than me, she is. Okay, so if she ever went, if she ever y'all went to the, to the other side, with a hot like a pocket night, she, right? she could play the part. Uh, he got to have tissue. Hey, <laughs> I'm about to make me sound. If she ever tried to look lie like to a you. man versus she could play the part. I ain't going to lie to you. Uh, look, I ain't going to lie to you. The titties, the titties, look, 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 look. The difference between, look, 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 look. The difference between Vin Diesel and a stud is the titties. Because his titties is gonna be manly. Hers is still, she's still chick. They, nigga, they might be yeah, tanks. We gonna untape him. Bro, this is homie who say he ain't, he don't mind getting handled by she ho. <laughs> the <laughs> fuck, nigga? <laughs> that's by Snoo Snoo. The fuck is you talking about? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Man, yeah, she ain't Amazon to me and she ain't putting shit in me. But last time I checked, she still got a pussy. And I'm pretty sure that shit still gets stimulated. <laughs> And you also it gotta be particular because when China had the jaw and shit like that, like when she first uh, showed up, no, nah. like fucking punk girl. Nah, I'm not. No, 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 no. That 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 one, that one, that one, that one wasn't it. That one, that one wasn't it. I even wrote down that thing wrong, so I didn't even know what the fuck I was getting into on this question. I thought I was going somewhere else. I wrote, yes. I wrote something to completely else that got, I miss, I wrote two I wrote two letters wrong and it changed he the whole. He thought we were going to Legoland. Nah, nigga, this is Let's Go Land. <laughs> God damn. Shit is out of there. But now, nah, Kevin, toy, you, had, you had this one. You said should DJ quick uh, be held in the same re- regard. Thank you. I meant as, to bring that up as Dr. Dre. Yes. <clears throat> Hell yes. I want to hear y'all break this down. For because real. one, on top of seeing all the other shit. DJ Quick gave Tyke, we gonna get to your we gonna get to your question shit. after he, this topic. That, that, that's the thing. DJ Quick is the ism. Bradley, you too. But then I also felt like he shouldn't. And the re- damn, <laughs> nigga started a firecracker <laughs> like a motherfucker. That nigga, that nigga, Dracar is motherfucker. <laughs> Light and lumber. <laughs> how much can we get? How much wood can we get for this? About this much. <laughs> Boom. Nah, uh, damn. Uh. uh Wood don't grow on trees. <laughs> the reason why, the reason why I said no. Okay. Even though I fuck with DJ Quick Heavy. Hold up. The reason why I said no, because he only made one sound, and you stayed in your city. But Doctor, you can. There's all. There's an argument that Doctor Dre just make half of his. Uh, he stole the other people. He got interns and other workers. He got a team. So. Dr. Drake argument is the Drake argument. Fucking Drake. I'm, I, that, that's going that's my stand. And then he now what you know is who you know. And that's fine. Sure. I'm just saying that's why in certain instances. But Drake done done a lot of his beats too though. Hmm? Drake done done a lot. Drake done done a lot of his beats. I'm not saying he did, but I'm saying that's why that's what elevates him past DJ Quick. So in the in, in the in the essence of when should DJ Quick be in the same vein as Dr. Drake, I say yes. For the simple fact that at the time period they doing the same shit. Now, granted, the other argument why Dr. Dre would be surpassed him is that Dr. Dre is damn near dropped the artist in every damn near, in every era. You know what I'm saying? And, and that's and that's what I'm saying. I I, I agree. I, like- I agree and disagree with what with what he said because I feel like he's hitting on it. He's just in the wrong. I just feel like you in the wrong lane on it. As far as it's like an E, no, 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 as far as far as like E forty to me, like no, but, and, and but, too short. But like, even though they're both you know worldwide and you know we're, we're not, but you only uh-huh. know you you. I don't want to say you're not p- known for that. Part area, of your like, part of your answer is what's playing in to why I say that he's right. Like he's. Both of y'all are both of y'all are right. We all like you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, y'all y'all just y'all just in y'all just in two separate lanes because <laughs> because because yeah, yeah. because <laughs> doc, because doc, the, the only thing that the only thing that separates Dr. Dre from DJ Quick is the fact that you know what I'm saying how much he's been 
like in people's faces. You know what I'm saying? Like how you know what I'm saying? Yeah, just like, what I'm I agree. as far as just like the relevant Those thing. Are hits, DJ, but they, no, that that's true. But DJ Quick, that's for your hardcore hip hop heads. Man, you, you know what I'm saying? You Other than post? that, do you have the post? Because I, I tried to save it. I didn't save Other it. than that, DJ Quick when DJ Quick felt underground to a lot of motherfuckers by the 2000s. Man, you know what I'm saying? Now, I, 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 I fuck, I fucks again. I fucks with Quick. You know what I'm saying? As a producer and as a and, and as the and as you know what I'm saying, writing because he's, I mean, one of the true originals at that. Right? You know what I'm saying? Right? Uh, doing his own beats and writing to his shit, but legitimately doing both. Fucking put sugar free on, like pretty, got, like single handedly, pretty I'm much a, put a, this I'm man read, on. I'ma read what started this whole debate because DJ Quick started this himself. Oh yeah, it was the post online. He okay. said, like them beloved. He said, like that. I know it's early, but I deserve to be where Dre is. I don't think it's fair, but I understand why. I never had a machine behind me that always hurt my friends more than me, and he got more though. He said, my friends have come to me in, confid- in confidentiality and said, do your, mu- do, do your music like you want to, just be DJ Quick. People love that shit. This doesn't need to be on a podcast because you have fire starters who want to spend everything to get more ratings. But the truth is, I love Dr. Dre like a big brother, one, one I never had. It pains me when people pit us against each other. There is no automatic winning lottery ticket for everyone, period. On this planet, you get what you get. But it's what you do with what you have been given to work with that makes you a star. I know I'll never be as popular as I need to be, but I have tens of artists, superstars, and when they shine, I just smile. <coughs> the janitor doesn't get all the glory, but he keeps the backstage uh, clean as a triad. This is not a meltdown. I'm just expressing myself as neutral. My nigga speaking that real ass shit. Everything he, he said was actual fucking factual. He just, that's what Everything saying. he said, like, for real. And now it's like, you can't take issue with nothing that he just said right there. That's real shit. And that's what I want to That's real, like, that's cool. real shit. Because, like, it's not like, he not hating it. No, nah, he like, not hating it. He not hating it. That ain't hating it. That 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 that's just keeping it real. And a lot of times when people, <laughs> people who are immature minded, they would try to take that, that shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, motherfuckers, motherfuckers want to be immature and be toxic and shit. So they want to turn that into, oh, no, hey, there ain't that ain't that ain't hating at all. Hey, that's just keep that's just keeping it real. Like that's just what it is. And, and like I I find it crazy that he dropped that shit right after I just mentioned his ass in the bar, and I'm saying like that nigga's the <coughs> ism, bro. Like we don't get play of music without him. Like period. I look that shit up. I don't drop bars unless I look the shit up. We don't get like pimp shit at all without him. We don't get those type of melodies and cadences. And this. We don't get Snoop Dogg. Bro, without, the we West, don't get the bro, most the, the West most Coast sound, artists. period, bro. The, the West like the Coast most, sound, the period. The most famous artist on the planet is Snoop Dogg. We don't, get, we don't get Snoop Dogg without DJ Quick. Look, where do you think that hairstyle and shit come? Like, bro, like, this, bro, this motherfucker, bro. And, that, and that's my biggest reason for why, like, nah, yeah, hell yeah. He should be right up there, right next to that nigga. And when you talk beefs and shit in the rap game or whatever like that, people love to bring up Nas and Jay-Z or whatever like that, but they did. De- bring up MC8 and DJ Quick, though. Damn. DJ Quick freaking, DJ Quick freaking smashed that Smash shit. The Smash the fuck out of it. And it's like, okay, hey, for motherfuckers who, th- again, who think it's sweet because they hear all these West Coast niggas and they think, oh, they just on that low ride of gangster shit. Like them niggas don't rap, rap. No, nah, them niggas, them rapping. niggas rap, bro. Oh, you know what I'm saying? And that's really everywhere, no matter where. That's why I don't like people like, oh, on the East Coast we do this or, or the South down South. This, and and it's like, like, man, nah, it's nah, motherfuckers nah. everywhere, bro, who be spitting, spitting shit. for real, I, for real, I, I no matter that, where the I fuck. Take, what that nigga Jordan say? I took that personally. <laughs> I took that. Don't say the South can't rap, bitch. Oh, I will take your shit. Bro. I will take your shit and make a hit, bitch. Don't play me. You ain't fucking lying. You ain't lying on that one. But uh nah, that but that was a good ass topic. I like that shit. Now uh Tyke Lyons says, uh hold on, let's get to this right quick. Bradley says, When we gonna get the white guy on the podcast? Well now that we got I'm saying me back up right here and things like that, bro. We gonna definitely get that uh situated and try Monitors. to uh, and try to get that up in here, Bradley, Monitors. to figure out how we can get that. What's up? We gotta we gotta figure out. We gotta figure Monitors. out. Okay, bet that we gonna get on that. Uh, Tyke says worst movie you seen this year. Ha! Halloween ends. Easy as fuck. That is, you ain't even got that easy as fuck. <laughs> hey, bro, from way over here. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Hell yeah. That's Real the shit. Fact. Real shit. Cause it's like I was getting ready, like it was coming up <laughs> already, you, but I he was you. already there. <laughs> I'm like, for real, but that was the worst and movie the I've ever seen this year. Best movie would be Everything, Everywhere, All at Once. I just had to put these niggas on that bitch and watch it again. And I doubled down. That bitch is the best.
best movie of this year. Probably the best movie of the past five to ten. Was that a 2022 movie? That, yeah, this year. It was this. It was this year. Damn, I can't think of came out, a movie I watched. Came out like a little bit after or before Bullet Train. That's my show. Oh God, I can't think of a bad movie I watched. I ain't gonna lie. Exactly. Boy, them hoes. Oh, okay. So, not you don't. Have, it doesn't have to be like. I'm not gonna lie. People I like this guy. Halloween ends. Does that help me which movies to watch? That is true. But <laughs> I, I'm that nigga. If you want movies, let me know. I got you. But don't. All right. So it doesn't have to be the worst. Like objectively. But what's, what's the one that you didn't like? Like, that you didn't too much care for after watching it? Is, did you have one? or did Bradley you, agrees. Did you you enjoyed everything that you seen? You, you a lucky motherfucker. I can't trust his critique on nothing. I don't, I like, don't no, think he remember. Especially, I don't know especially with bro, the fact that you like no, Halloween, I do believe, bro. No, I believe, no, I believe in though for the simple fact that he tells us what he watching every week. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, he literally, he watches certain shit, and that's all he got time to watch, because it's like, he got four shows or whatever he watching. Like, he on Disney, or he on uh, Star Wars. But see, that's, this, it. That, that, that's like, the thing, you know what I'm but that's us doing a lot of series, though. You know what I'm saying? Because we watch a lot of TV series, and stuff, which I, I feel like I we do. I the Star Wars movies. That's, that's what, what I'm saying. saying. Like, he going through those. I, so I, like, I, I, I finished the Star I mean, besides the, t- the three new ones. Or two but when ones. he said, but when he say worst movie, though, I don't think he talking about what you got in your Blu-ray collection or some shit like that. No, I'm talking about what, like, what I've actually movie. watched like, this year for movies. <clears throat> The movies that I watched, I with some I, good, with some good shit. I mean, oh, no, that's what's I guess, up. I guess like twenty twenty two. No, that, that, no, that's what's up. I mean, nah, it was shit. Was, shit was pretty or freaking or lit though. What was the? Batman, Batman was much more worse. D Batman. Uh, oh, you know what? So no, I did, I did hurt him. One, we went to the drive-in, and <laughs> I didn't, I didn't think shit. I, I should have knew because it was a Batman movie, but. I didn't think they was gonna do it how they did it, and it was a little too dark. And bro ended up falling asleep and shit, and he didn't end up liking Batman because he, he just couldn't see shit. And we had to drive shit, in. All I'm saying is listening to it. All he can see is little so, that shit move. But so I'm yeah, like, he went to sleep. <laughs> he was he was sleeping. <laughs> he was sleep about half of that bitch. So I, <laughs> uh, I, 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 I get. Like, like, what the one. fuck is this shit? <laughs> I give you that one. <laughs> yeah, but like, we uh, it like, like, like 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 the like the black lady in the memes and shit like. Yeah, I got it. That look like. That look like. Young Jeffrey Wig. Damn, bro. Yeah, nah, that was good. Golly. Yo. Bradley, God. where my Uber at? <laughs> Bradley, you agree with the best or the worst? Which one do you agree with? Best I, know, I, think best when, we, I think when we say Halloween. Oh, okay. The, hollow, the Halloween one. Because I, would, I wouldn't be mad if I you didn't said agree with that either one. Damn, I killed that. I caught like a part of Halloween, and once I realized this, it's too much for hey, me. Hey, why Sonic staring at these niggas in their face, though? Like, right, bro, that nigga looking into your Authoritative soul. shit. He's like, <laughs> hey, he's like, hey, I heard you motherfuckers ain't been pouring for a couple of times. That motherfucker Sonic man. trying to check some shit. Like, hey, look. Nigga, why you got vegan cookies? Hey, look, this is what happened. You got, look, you got what? weed. You went vegan? These ain't vegan cookies. No. Yes, they are. They say vegan on that bitch. Oh, for real? He didn't even know. He said, these hoes. Oh, said, okay. Then I've still been doing good then. He said, these hoes delicious. <laughs> Hell yeah. I've been thinking I've been cheating this whole time and shit. I've been look, doing good. Fuck yeah. Look, look, this is the difference. Hell yeah. Now, you know. them hoes hitting. Look, this is the difference between weed. I can even tell, though, for real. And alcohol. <laughs> Rasta Bear is the weed. <laughs> Sonic is the alcohol. He's like, what you say, bitch? He really like, wait, <laughs> angry hitting. drunk, like, for real. <laughs> Five shots Other than that, he just like, hey, when he's sober, he just like y'all see on the TV shows and the video games, all that shit. Then you got Willie that, Nelson uh, and little Archie over there just like, I'm watching. Six shots of Hitty, man. I'm watching whatever goes on. They trying to make music <laughs> together. Shit. Real yeah. shit. <laughs> Boy, What's that's that duo? What was that duo? <laughs> fucking that duo name, that fucking music duo. On what? In general, is that you, they make them fucking silly songs that Peter and Quagmire did a parody of. Fucking something in Garfunkel, goddamn it! That's oh, Simon no, uh, and Fra- Garfunkel. Si- that's yeah, there you, you go, there you go, there you go. <laughs> that's you and fucking uh, Wizzy. Damn! <laughs> Damn. Wait, you say that next. Oh! You know what you mean? That's, you, that's y'all right there. <laughs> Damn! Bro, that that ni- yo, he just referenced something that <laughs> old as fuck, bro. I'm, to the point where Kitty Foreman from that '70s show referenced that back then, and that was considered oh. old then. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm saying, like, bro, 
Fuck. Nigga. <laughs> My hey, teacher. look, that's like, huh. can't, hey, look, I'm young, bitch, but you can't say I don't know my shit. Nah, that's a, nah, <laughs> hey, hey, you're the, bow, nah, well, that shit was lit, though, class. for real, though, because that's super fucking and throwback. They were having a roast session, nigga came out of nowhere and roasted the fuck out of this white dude because of his hair. Oh, man. And what? said, bitch, I know you ain't talking, you look like Simon and Garfunkel. <laughs> and Miss Moleman in the back of the class busted out laughing. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you know. Your teacher ain't shit. You've been quiet the whole time. Once you get the teacher, if you can get the teacher to crack, that's how you know. But now, but see, you got 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 up crying, laughing. Nah, but see, you already know the teacher was good if she let you get two of those off. If y'all was able to get more than two of those (laughs) off, that teacher already (laughs) fucking golden. Because they be trying to shut that shit down. You guys gotta understand this moment. This moment was like this little short 411. You ain't gonna tell a whole bunch of them. A classroom, they get rowdy, start rowdy. Hey, shit, you can tell them. Man, you ain't I, 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 I done had some short teachers, bro, who done had some, who can hold that shit. Oh, yeah, that's the difference. Because the short black lady, I said, sit the fuck down. Oh, God, smacking rulers and shit, throwing books across. That meter stick, nigga. I hate that meter stick. No, nigga, I just knew that if I got in any trouble in school, that she was going to talk to my auntie because they were sorority sisters. Ah, oh, see, yeah, that's the nope. word. Nope, see, I had Mr. Kowski. Mm-hmm. And then, nope. Uh, mm-hmm. Nigga, I came, I walked nope. home from school. Nah, nigga, he said Miss Mormon. Nigga, she ain't doing shit, Mr. Kowski. She gonna swag some shit, though. <laughs> she gonna pull out that wooden spoon. She, on hey, ass. she was not <laughs> fucking playing. And what was messed up is there, there, was two of, there was two of them. One was a stud and the other one wasn't. So at first, we thought they ass was married and shit. They wasn't even fucking related. How do you get two Miss Chakowskis in the same fucking school and they not even fucking related? I got a joke, but I can't say it because Kanye just got canceled. Damn. Uh, okay. <laughs> matter of fact, matter of fact, of speak it up. Speak it up. I next topic, to cancel culture. That's exactly what's up next. Boy, I'll I be was fucking like, boy. Please, Kevin, don't say nothing fucked up. Please, Kevin, don't say nothing fucked up. Please, Kevin, don't say nothing fucked up. Cancel and culture. here you come. And I was like, damn, you when I was thinking out say. loud. <laughs> So look, university pulls offer from high school quarterback after video shows him rapping the N word, and the bro had to give out. He gave out a full apology and shit like that. And I'm sorry, bro. This this I, this is bullshit. Like you you fuck this nigga whole life up because he rapping to a song that's probably popular as fuck. He can fucking say that shit, bro. It's a fucking song. You know, it's online, bro. bro that, but. Even still, bro apologize, understand it's not right, blah, 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 blah. He got to fucking censor himself in his own fucking life. I get it. That's fine. Whatever the fuck. That's bullshit, bro. I also he shouldn't think have his scholarship took it from him, fam. That's bullshit, bro. I also think it's fucked so up when people have fucked up situations and they apologize immediately and still get canceled. Now, at one point in time, is there any... Say, hey, you know, I'm sorry. It's a teachable moment. And that's him. That, that's what I'm saying. I, I can read Teach his, me. Look, he say, I was in the car listening to rap music, rapping along to words, and posted a video of it on social media. I deeply apologize for the words in that song that I chose to say. It was hurtful and offensive to many people, and I regret that. I fully accept the consequences for my actions, and I respect the University of Florida's decision to withdraw my scholarship off to play football. My intention was never to hurt anybody and recognize that even when going along with a song, my words can still carry a lot of fucking weight. No, the fuck he can't, bro. What's his name? No, bro. And then he, I strive to be better and become the best version of myself, both on and off the field. I know how that go, bro, and I respect you for it. And that shit is His name is Marcus Stokes. And I, that shit not fucking right, bro. I, 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 I'm I, sorry, bro. That Hold shit, on, so you talking about... He apologized. Hold on, wait. That kid lost his scholarship? Because yeah. he rapped nigga on the fucking song, and he he posted probably through a Snapchat or some shit. Like, I, I'm not with that shit, bro. No, 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 no. Hold on. I'm with, okay, I agree the punishment. I agree the punishment is harsh. Because that, bro, like, you talk he about. He's not even talking to nobody. No, bro, bro, here's the thing, though. You talk about these are things that, that when you go. Bro, you know, bro, do you know how many, you know how many people I done came across who were, you know what I'm saying, like, dope fiends and shit like that? Who had opportunities like that? That that was the thing that fucking slipped through their fucking fingers before like, they fam, went off. You but, fuck this nigga like life for up, real, bro. like that's some whole that ass shit. Stupid, that that's shit hard. That, that, that's that's hard, bro. That's harsh. That shit harsh. That shit harsh. That shit harsh. No, 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 no. But hold on, I'm about to be for you. I'm about to be for you because while that's harsh as shit, he deserve everything that came his way because, bro. While you being a fucking athlete and doing that shit again, this is Snapchat. Right, you know. We know how Snapchat work and shit. You post that shit. You didn't have to fucking do that shit to begin with. 
You know what I'm saying? You could have sat there, number one, since you want to be quick with your thumb and you want to keep clicking and go to the next one and the next one and the next one. Not, bro. Well, if I was, you know what? Well, you should have been smart vibing because you on a football team and know your pos and awesome, bro. But go, but know, but knowing again, knowing your platform, bro. You gotta go back, go back and review your shit. Now, great. Got a platform? Yeah. I. It ain't even that bad. Bro, I. No. You seen it? You just looked it up. Bro, that's what. All he said was, "Welcome back." And bro, and this is what I'm saying. And this is what I'm saying. It's dumb and care. It's dumb and careless on his part. Like that's just stupid. It's stupid and careless on his part. But at the same time, that punishment is harsh as fuck. It's dumb. He dumb and careless as fuck for that shit. He don't deserve a punishment. You know what? He did not. He does. He, he doesn't deserve shit. You know. You know. If somebody not, wants to come punch him in his mouth for it, fine. That's what I'm saying. He just come on with it. Like that's baby, powder me up because that's but who exact... the fuck are these niggas to take his fucking life away from him, bro? That's, that's the dumb, part I'm not bro. with. What's something he posts on Snapchat? That's you know what what that's the shit. He on rap it. That's his personal song. fucking life. That ain't got shit to do so with you. So he can't you listen niggas. to that song. Is what y'all saying? What, what school? What school did he go to? He was finna go to Florida. I don't know exactly what high school, what high school or nothing. But in he, Florida, Florida, what the but, fuck? But right now, he one of the best high school football players in the country. But it's all and it's off to, to University of Florida. Yeah, like, Florida of all schools. Florida of all schools. <laughs> all them little gists out there running around, gold teeth up, riding around in, 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 in dumps. Grady Poe up. And uh, 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 and shit. You gotta put eight thousand. Y'all gonna get mad because white boy. It, 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 it's just it's, that shit. Welcome that's too. Back, that's too nigga. much, bro. We got way other fuck? shit. You got Balenciaga over there doing shit that with kids shit, and shit. Wow. Doing, you know what I'm saying? And y'all worry about a uh, fucking high school kid. This people nigga's a kid, bro. This this nigga's a fucking kid, bro. People pay, pay, people pay attention to the wrong shit. Like, y'all yeah. hype that up for and get on his ass, but y'all encourage this period, uh, period, uh, bitch, and make her all types of famous. Who's that, bro? You don't even want to know. know. She got that drug at the mall. It is one of them instances where somebody's basically making a mockery of hip hop and shit of what the fuck we got going on. And in reality, it's funny as fuck because that's all music sounds like right now. But they hyped her up and they done turned her into a fucking internet bad baby type shit. And it's like, oh, God. now y'all finna get in some shit, some steam to run on. Trash. On man. bullshit. Like, why are y'all focused on bullshit? Man, I don't know. This shit fucked me up. What's next, bad. bro? I don't even want to think about Three this. Three things that women why, why hate to hear. Why bring this shit up? <laughs> <laughs> said, yeah, let's, hell yeah. Right. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Let's go, nigga. Ooh, let's fuck these hoes feelings. All right, so. You, yeah, nigga. Ooh. I wrote this down. I was thinking. <laughs> <laughs> they got zero, bro. I'm dead, bro. That shit fucked me up. Man. These football topics gonna get me, but let's go. If you were telling a woman, uh -huh. which one of these three, which one of these three things do you feel would hurt you. the yep. most? I got you. A a Number yeah. one, this pussy ain't Sick. worth this. Uh, you can build this conversation. You want to tackle Bradley question first? Cause I, I think I know what you're talking about. Hold on, Bradley did ask a question. He says, uh, Bradley say, okay, so we all know I'm white. As snow, are you saying if I'm spitting three six mafia, it's okay to speak every word? No, not Bra okay. Bradley. Know Bradley. your surroundings and know where you at. Thank you. If you yeah. by yourself, bro, let do that shit out. You do. Do I don't give a fuck, bro. What the fuck? But just Don't know, but just even know, if but you just, hanging around your nigga friends, and they cool with it, you know what I'm saying? Like, but just, but do? just, but just know you probably can't go across the street no, with yeah. it or around the corner with it, Cause Cause people or that certain, because that everybody, you know, it's just it's one of those things. People that, don't, people that don't know you. They don't know your intentions. They don't know that you're trying to die. You know, they don't know what you really like. They don't know. What you're really, like, they don't know 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 you can imagine arguing, she arguing with you, the nigga get up and be like, you know what? Your pussy ain't worth this. <laughs> <laughs> you don't uh, believe. All right, that's one. In the middle of it. Two, Ingrid, yeah, in the middle of argument, all right? Number two. I'm just in the middle of it. I'd be damned to argue with a bitch whose pH balance is off. <laughs> Damn. Next, what's next? Damn. Number three. I see why all the other bitches be laughing at you now. <laughs> the last one. Definitely the last one, cause who the fuck is them other little bitches? Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> that's it right there. Right there. Nah, that's it right there. It is right that's there. it right there. That's what's gonna make her want to stay. Nah, actually, I'll nah, that's bro. Nah, that's nah gonna, you just gonna get your ass killed. That's what I'm saying. That's, <laughs> that's, that's, that's first 48, bro. Fuck. That's first 48 all <laughs> day, <laughs> bro. Like, right God, Just asking for it, fam. God, Lee. 
Bang. Porsche is at number three. Bang, boy. Number three. Hey, number three, number three, three my lord. lord. Number three. three. Go number three, my lord. <laughs> you fuck around. You fuck around. Hear that? Real quick. Uh, fuck around. Had a whole fat Stewie front feet. five. Oh, Damn. Grass. Nah, shit. <laughs> I ain't, yeah. Nah, that's it. Cause if you, see, now if you do the multiple things together, you're in the heat of, of the argument. And she just say something. If you say. Man, that's, I get why these bitches be talking bad about you. And you just walk oh off? Oh, nigga. Oh, nigga. 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 And two brute. <laughs> nigga, she gonna run out one. Man. That nigga say, eat two brute. <laughs> Nah, I say first of all, don't know, none of y'all, huh? Don't none of y'all better not ever do that shit. Cause as soon as, cause as soon as you do that, you done fucked us all and blew up the earth. Because that shit ain't just gonna get taken out. That shit ain't just gonna get taken out on just you. That shit gonna get taken out on a whole bunch of other motherfuckers. Cause y'all know how they like you. You, you about, don't fucking don't fucking do that shit. Don't you gonna kill us. You gonna kill us all. Don't, like, don't, don't do fucking that. do that. Shit. Don't, you gonna be the first. Nah, not even that nigga. She finna go to Facebook. What is she? She finna air out all your dirty chicken. What's crazy, crazy look, she gon' air out Let's all see, your dirty laundry. Let's see, did he pour it up in the prom town? She go, she go, she go air out all your dirty laundry on top of throwing some lies in that bitch to where everything sounds believable. So now, you done caught an STD by fucking a tranny and did all these other shit. Ooh, I think that's bad, but we gon' bleep that somewhere, somewhere. We keep going, I'ma keep talking so we can keep on moving. Let's just keep going. All right, start talking, keep pull going, up then. Uh, Michael Grady asked from the Island Boys, the Ice Spice, hip hop hasn't been the same. What do they do to, what do they need to do to change that? Leave them alone. Leave them the fuck what alone. Happened? What happened? <laughs> The Ice Island Boys, the Ice Spice. Oh, uh, leave them niggas right there with a fuck. Leave them in South Florida. In no, the it fucking... ain't that. If they're trash, leave them alone. I swear leave to God. The fuck Where the fuck the little pump at? Ain't nobody said shit about that motherfucker. That, I think that's not that good. Shit trash. eventually, no, shit eventually just oh, like if it's him, good, Island man. Boys, Six Nine, all them. You eventually fucking fall off. You right. know what I'm saying? When that shit ain't good, so. That's just is what it is. I mean, that's I, I mean, why y'all think why y'all think why y'all think we don't just sit here on the fucking podcast and just be sitting here what ripping on get? motherfuckers all the time. What's the fucking point? Like that, like you know that. what I'm saying? So like, like exactly. Would y'all say six said, nine fell off? Yeah. He huh? said he said the nigga don't even make music. He though. said where's Chingy at? Like, where's Chingy? Where motherfucking Sean Kingston at? No, Chingy. But I mean, every time he do drop, no, Chingy's right there, right there. <laughs> and I'll be on the charts. He, but no, but his his single is, but his shit ain't sent like. They done the me the music game done changed the narrative to where people think they selling and really the only thing they selling are they singles and yeah, it's I'm not the, it's not the like whole process. Like eight songs that motherfucker got mad the last time, like time his album dropped. Songs. He was crying and he shit, ripping shit off the wall albums. and shit. Yeah, you, you talk you're thinking about uh, the motherfucker that came out with uh, I'm in love with that go go. He got shit too. He ain't got no album. Yeah, he do. No, he don't. You so talking about OT Genesis? Genesis? <laughs> OT Genesis do got albums, nigga. He got shit, bro. He hard. That nigga OT got shit, bro. I mean, he just, he's, he's super under. Nah, but he, and he's still making money saying, off of for interviews. For a main doing... artist to have an album, he don't. He only comes out with singles. Oh, he like the road. I'll give you that. Yeah, he like the road. Yeah, but so, for certain album, people, that's not bad. Right, but even they drop albums, you just don't care for them. Which I is thought, okay for single, single. Which is okay. No, single, he has them hoes, but it's, we don't listen to Nah, music. Grady, that's what we know. Nah, that's what we're talking about. If you want hip hop to no, get back to where it is, you gotta just leave that shit alone. First, and it's gonna, album, that shit's gonna happen. You stop giving that whack shit attention, on, then we'll get it. back to where we are. 6 ix first album, all of the fucking shit trended. That's why you think he only had singles, because every, every song was dropped as a single, and then he put it as an they album. Put it really as an album. That, but on, OT yeah. Genesis got one album. It's called Coke and Butter. That came out in 2016. Yeah. And none of them feature the songs that are, we all know. The rest of them, he, he's only came out the fucking singles. Okay. That's what I'm saying. Like he's not a, he's not a. He's not, he's not, he's not like a main. He's not even like a main Go-Gitter rapper, Go-Gitter. rapper like that though. Like he. He a street nigga who rap. That. <laughs> <laughs> he is a street nigga who yeah, rap. Oh snap! Hold up, Porsche. With that 1,326 days sippage, Grady got 587 days sippage in this thing. Pull up then, smash on them. Yeah, no, nah, I answered them on that. On the, I, already, I told them, I was like, all right, well, we, our response to that is basically what that is. You leave that whack shit alone, it's gonna die. then it's going to die and fade out, bro. Yeah. And the real shit's going to go back up. But see, it's also it's on the fans, though, again, which is 
again, like we say, you leave that whack shit alone, you don't give it no attention, yeah. then which it's why, there. But dude, Which is why I hate the argument when motherfuckers be like, this arrow is better than this. No, nigga, you just forgot the trash. Like, huh. let's keep it a bean. You forgot the trash, which is what you're supposed to do. And when we get to fucking 2035, we can think about this time. We're not thinking about Lil Pump. We're not think. We may laugh about Gucci Gang, but we're not even gonna know who fucking did it. No, we're gonna be talking about like, man. You Remember that Zelda was hair? killing it though. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? We're Motherfuckers gonna be talking about, about shit. We, we'll still, be, really we'll still talk about Lil Baby. We'll still talk about some of the people like Red. Everybody may not like them, but we'll still talk about them niggas just for the simple fact they made an impact. But all that trash shit, man. Say, errors is errors. Oh damn! That damn. Yeah. Kevin over there with the 1,970 <laughs> days. <laughs> God damn. Like, really, every- it's like, if motherfucker drop, he just got to come over there. It's like, man, you know what? I forgot, to, key, put, I forgot to put my nuts on a forehead today. Nigga say, Bow! Nigga say, I was the first to climb out every So if a, if a male does it, it's called a tea bag. What, what does he call it when the female does it? Tea bag? Oh, I guess. What, clam slam? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Boy, it's stupid. It's called a clapback. <laughs> no, you know what? I think you just—I think you legitimately gave it a good one. The cooter shooter. I, think <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. That's by Snoop Snoop. That's what we call it. It's not a bad. That's a thing. Women have so many advantages in that aspect because it's negative if your nigga drop his balls on you. Bitch, you can drop that pussy on me all you want. Fuck you talking about. Uh, <laughs> Grady say lip smack. <laughs> yeah, he named yeah. that shit a band like a bitch. He's like, hey, yeah, 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 right. we gonna... he got lip smacked. <laughs> oh, hey, what he say? Mm. Let it go up, let it aerate. Vanilla. Little cinnamon. Oh, uh, shit. Is that yeast? Mm. <laughs> got a little bit. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> yo, yo, okay. All right, y'all. All right, yeah. Uh, and this motherfucker got the year right afterwards. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, there's just too much going on. Simple, just pat. We, we, we fucking wildin'. Uh, let's see. Good morning, America. Okay. Uh-huh. Why the fuck are we talking about Good Morning America? Why? What the fuck did Good Morning America do? To deserve to be on Drake the Kool Aid's fucking podcast. Y'all yeah, know the co-host, Two right? Two co-hosts. Shut up, motherfucker. I got it. Main. I got this. Go ahead. Mine. You don't bring topics. <laughs> Damn. The <laughs> so fuck. I can bring y'all bitches. <laughs> yeah, I can bring y'all bitches. <laughs> All right. So. <laughs> oh shit. All right, Good Morning America co-hosts Amy Robach and TJ Holmes have reportedly been taken off air after rumors of their romantic relationship and images emerge a month after they both separated from their spouses. Again, cancel culture doing shit that they ain't got nothing to do with. Because these are both, they both separated and they both, in they, if they not divorced already or in the divorce process, right? So that means you're separated legally and shit, right? Yeah, I'm, you're married, so you don't know. ask me that. I, I know you're not, but I'm saying, but that that's like a term or something. Do you know? Nope. Okay, cool. Then. These niggas say never that's happening not, to me. Not in my dictionary. Yeah, I got, no, I got you. I got you. So, I don't even know what that is. But but I'm saying that to say that. What is this walking in? I don't like. I don't understand the purpose of like. Like, this ain't even like an Ime Doka situation where it's like some scandalous shit going on within the team or something like nah, that. Nah, it's one of the, I like, it's, this is kind of like the Vince McMahon situation where he got released, uh-huh. where like really he didn't do anything wrong, but because of. I guess this would, be, this would break the fraternizing between co workers policy, right? Well, you, I mean, if they, if they had, because I don't know, but if they, if they consider them, because. You know, with a show, like, if you on Good Morning America and you got, let's say you got three, four people on the stage, I'm pretty sure y'all are, like, the managers and shit like that, and everybody else will be under y'all. So if that type of thing is there, then maybe. I don't know if that's how they work, but if that is how they work, then I could then I could see that. But that's what it, that's pretty much what it looks like. Because when you on TV every day and you presenting this show one, one way, yeah. people gonna be people, and that's gonna be... On their mind, I'm like, oh, these kids really busy. Like that. That's what they do. Like, well, well, they do people, people they, every time they go like, to commercial the reason, break, they are divorcing their fucking people because and getting together is because they've been fucking. Who gives a fuck? 
No, we no. You're right. You're right. Nobody yeah, should give. Nobody yeah. should give a damn. Which is why. That's which, life. but, but it's, but it's with because. because, like, because am I tripping? No, the no, the people who the people the show run. <laughs> no, the show the, the showrunners and shit. The showrunners, I'm pretty sure feel the same way you do. Yeah. But they know how fucking petty people are. They know how messy people are. These like social media like though. motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Right. So for them to protect their bottom line because of these motherfuckers, now they got to make a decision that they probably didn't want to make. You know what I'm saying? These are, and I'm looking at them. These are the same motherfuckers that's been on there forever. Bro, the, the black dude in the what's called. Think of it like this. I think think they, of the. They gonna bring them back. Though. Think of the. Think of the crowd that's what. Think of who's what. Who the fuck's Man, watching Good Morning America? Podcast together. Fuck think it. of the audience who's watching Good Morning America. What time does this shit even air? <laughs> like what four, six in the morning? I, like eight. I don't know. It's no, definitely got to be between a seven and nine, I somewhere get, between I, there. I, 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 those type of those type bro, those type of motherfuckers who watch that Good Morning America type shit, they know they like, man, damn, why you motherfuckers got to go do some dumb shit like this? We don't want to have to do this, but for it's us not, to stay in business, for us to not for us to not, no, it makes sense. You with when you work, go to work somewhere, you with that person ninety nine percent of the time. Like you with them more than anybody else in your fucking life. A lot of times, especially these type of jobs where. We know how, nigga, they prep four hours before, they do this shit, then afterwards they do some more work shit. They, like, they yeah. literally always together. What they had going on in their household ain't got shit to do with, like, fuck, we both single now. Let's fucking, like, what the, like. No, you're, no, weird. you're, I'm, I'm, and again, I'm with you on that, bro. Like, I'm, and I, again, I'm, I'm pretty sure the people who at the TV station or whoever run the show. Hey, but he in there. Hey, is the hey, same. Hey, hey, he, is the, she, she in the back. Hey, he let me see the picture. Hey, nah, look, I gotta see hey, this look, shit, hey, bro. Look, nah, I need hey, to. He, hey, he on that ad, though. Hey, he, it's, he's smacking for real. Oh, damn. <laughs> yeah, he's smacking for real. No, that like, oh, out. my God, what have you done? Vacation. Hey, but so they giggling at the bar and shit, nigga. They, they lit. They ain't worried about no shit y'all talk about. Honestly, see, I, I, and that, but see, and like, and that's like, I think they, I'm, I think uh, if they, if they get off the back, they shouldn't go. I think them niggas should start a pod. That'll be fucking lit. Uh, Cause they got their money. But I'm pretty sure. Only old ass folks ain't finna get Nah, probably Severus package. package. But they don't need Severus the, package. They, they, but the nigga, the, the old ass Severus, motherfuckers are the reason package. these niggas can't do shit. They the reason they got kicked off air. All the old motherfuckers. Unless they were fucking against the green screen. He said, unless they were fucking against the green screen, given the weather, chance of showers. Like that OnlyFans thing. Fuck that shit, man. Eighth grade teachers and shit. Like, unless they was fucking on the news table, fam. I ain't trying. Man, look. Them niggas need to go do some shit on their own. They shouldn't go back, though. I'm one of them niggas that once you burn me, fuck that shit. Because now... You niggas wrong. Y'all shouldn't even let nah, them. Nah, okay, but y'all. okay, but uh, nah, but but if you own, but let's say, if you own, let's just say, if you own the business, right? Okay. And then your employees did some shit. You know what I'm saying? That you didn't have a problem with, but was dumb because it affects your company's bottom line. Ain't no ifs, ands, or buts about it. You know for a fact that because of what these motherfuckers done done, whether you agree with it or not, it's gonna affect your bottom line. Are you gonna make that tough business decision and keep your shit rolling, or are you gonna worry about what the fuck these motherfuckers doing? Hmm. How good are they at their job? This is valid. No, no, that no, that no, that is a valid fucking point because at the same time, at the same, if you, they must not be that valued there. Then they must be replaceable. They must be, because I get, guess what? You know who that wouldn't have happened to? That wouldn't have happened to Michael Strahan. I'm, I'm just like, <laughs> that wouldn't have happened to Michael Strahan. I, 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 I think like, real what, shit, you I ain't think, like, nah, shit. Yeah, that's why I think demographic does have to be taken into account, because. They must uh, not, they must not be what that is. No, nah, I mean, they legit. They've been the same motherfuckers forever. I just think the, uh, the people that watch Good Morning America, like you said, they the ones that's. Happy, happily married. They, they we them don't believe in the, we like don't believe it. in divorce. We don't believe in what's so they and they marriage. And that's what I'm saying. Mad as hell. They do not like being married, but they gotta stay married because it's marriage. And, and they like, so, man, yeah. fuck so y'all done done this shit, and now we gotta fucking let y'all go because. These dumb motherfuckers, bro. You, you, y'all done seen this shit on TV shit, shows. I ain't gonna lie. I'm I the executive. Say, hey, man. <laughs> damn. I, why y'all gotta go do some dumb hey, ass look, shit like I'll, that? I'll y'all know these dumb ass motherfuckers who watch our show Fuck and support that. our shit hey, is look, gonna start bullshitting I'll now. Shit. Fuck. I don't I'll wanna have they, to let you go, I'll but fuck. We need I'll those dollar, dollar dollar bills, y'all. They, they no longer they no longer good morning, America. They, look, they, no more, they no longer good morning, America. They are America. No, no, no. No, 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 no. America. Me, oh, 
at night. At night. Because <laughs> now it's And you got to have the at symbol and everything. Like, you can't even, don't even just spell the shit out. You got to have the at symbol in that bitch. And it got to be highlighted in neon like them Taco Bell commercials. I would, and me personally, I think I would rearrange it rather than just drop them. Just for the simple fact, because if it don't go against my morals and I don't believe I should drop them as a business runner, me personally, <coughs> I'm going to be like, fuck that shit. We're going to get some money somewhere else. But at the same time, that's a big ass corporation and that's good morning America, goddammit. So I would move them around, but shit, just give them another show. If that, if it, that, that, that goes to the question of how good are they? You know what I'm saying? Now, if they're not that good, <laughs> but if they legit, you just move them yeah, around. South Park. We just, we just shuffle. <laughs> Respect my authority. <laughs> this is pretty much this is some shit that would happen to the broadcasters on Family Guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah, real talk, cause they awesome. Like shit. for real, that's the shit that be happening. The motherfucking uh, who's that? Tom and somebody. Tom else? And, uh, uh, see, we don't even know her name, cause she tried to kill Lois and shit. Fuck yeah, that fuck that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> they killed her ass off. Actually, no, nah, she ain't even. Yeah, nah, she no out of there. Yeah, yeah once they went to the magic bitch. first episode when they jumped that season off. I remember it, two thousand and nine. Oh god, I was like, oh, yeah, nigga, continuity. <laughs> that shit was fire. <laughs> All right, so whose house you pulling up to? Pull up. All right, so check it. People going back like, ooh, yeah, you can tell they were hunching right here. Oh, Portia talking about those reruns getting hella views. Oh, God. That's what I'm saying. Motherfuckers just be messy and on that drama and shit, though. Oh, and in reality, don't you, like, before we split, don't you think that would actually boost ratings? Temporarily, yeah. yeah. Long term, they, they no. started the OnlyFans. Yeah, right if, now. If, if, if the people that was like fuck it and they eventually not watched it, yeah, I get you. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, you get your little, you get your little temporary Sorry. boost and shit like that. But then a Marvel movie will come out and it's gonna blow you out the box office. Whose house are you going to? I'm going to Kim's house. You got Kim. Let's see. I'm gonna have to look at that plate up close. I'm gonna have to look at that up. Nah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need you to bring no, out. I, I, I didn't touch it. Let's go up a little bit. Yeah, then there you go, right there. Oh, okay, yeah, there we go. Okay, go down. Yeah. There you go, right there. So, okay, hold on. Yeah, no, let me bring that back because I still gotta see some more detail <laughs> up on this bitch. I gotta, ooh. Whose house you going to? Okay, so. Nicole, you got me fucked up. I understand what you was trying to do with Surf and Turf, but I can't yeah. trust you with no fucking stuff. I just learned what that is. <laughs> I understood that reference. Simone, I love your pasta, but that looked like it has a chance to make me throw up and have the shit. And I love Italian, so I'm kind of offended. Uh, Damn. Kim, your stuff is looking nice, but I'm sorry, I'm going with Maria. Y'all need yeah, okay. You got Maria. I ain't got nobody yet. All right, let's see. Kim, you already out of here. Maria got you like you Maria don't know what the fuck variety. you was doing over there. Just that plating. Just that plating. You're fucking up, Kim. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> uh, Maria. Maria, you too simple. I, know, I Just off your name and whatever, you ain't doing enough for your culture. You just not, you ain't shining enough, Maria. You know what I'm saying? Nicole. You bought that shit from Sam's Club. Simone. That Kroger space. I didn't want to say yeah, just for the simple fact you know why. But since it's since it's spelled a little differently. What's the difference to mine? Yeah. <laughs> That's <laughs> solid. <laughs> That's solid. <laughs> Besides that. That's solid. And on top of the fact that you look like you can cook. So for the you whole, okay? So you ain't. Oh, she look like she can cook for the whole house. That's a pot. She made that in a pot. Shut the fuck nigga, up, that's a, nigga. And that's that big pot, nigga. She not, made, not she, a skillet. She cooked for eight. You telling me Maria don't look like she can throw down for the whole crew? Hold on, I'm gonna save my. You with me, right? I'm. Yes. Don't say nothing. You with me, right? You pick. You like with... I got a Harry. You got to pick so I can get this. Kevin, by ready to fucking. Close. <laughs> <It's slow. laughs> Yes, I'm going food. with Kim. Okay. With that stove ball ass fucking cornbread roll right there and shit. That, that looked like a homemade roll. That look homemade. That's straight out the pan. With the muffin With pills the muffin off. top off and all that. Anyway, I'm not picking Maria's motherfucking taco. Bitch, you got the Mexican American tacos. Don't no motherfucking real Mexican person got hard shell tacos. No Get your Taco right Bell have it ass about my house. Now, granted, I do like hard shells, but he's right. I would prefer if you're going to make my shit, you better get that corn. You better do it with your fucking hands. Double too. the tortilla. You better, the fuck you better, up, you better no. not do that. First you of all. You don't double my tortilla because that means you spent money on no, two No, y'all fuck. 
first of all, why you talking about the fucking shell and the tortilla? Nah. That's on the motherfucker who's about to eat it. Because you're just supposed to make the shit up, and then you have the shit on your plate, and then you do your own shit while it's staying on your plate. The, but I'm looking but, at the plate. Well, you double the tortilla. And like I said, if the, I want some, I want some authentic Mexican food, if you're going to give it to me. And then, Simone, and, and, that ain't and Mexican queso, food. The queso came out that Rico can, bro. The yellow and red yeah, can. Nah, bro. That shit came with tomatoes in it. I ain't trying to mix that shit. Nah, fam. Make a roux and make my shit from scratch. Bro, that queso. Bro, came Simone out of can. shit, bro. Simone you know shit gonna, gonna have your Mexican ass on the shitter, bro. And you probably gonna throw up like cheese. Jamie Foxx did in any given See, Sunday. That's for you weak stomach ass niggas. Nah, I'm fuck that. Human garbage that. disposal. I, bro, I love pasta, and that shit, like, it looks good and disgusting at the same damn time. Simone <laughs> shit, dude. <laughs> Mexican American taco. <laughs> Bottom left. Ah. What's bottom left? That's what bottom left is Simone. Simone. That's what Port- Portia we right along. Now, as long as we don't put no raisins in Bottom good. right, you got Nicole. She got the surf and turf. Kim got the soul food in the top, top left. But see, Kim also lose points, too, because that shit right there, not only is that fucking leftovers, because if you look at that, see the box. that shit came from the bottom of the fucking pot and shit. Scoop that shit the, up yeah, and the then reheat it and shit like that. You got me fucked up. What are you talking about? That reheat ass plate. Yeah. yeah. Did Fuck got, no. Ain't no. There ain't no meat on that Fuck bitch. No. Just bones and gravy. Point the duck shit. Just bones and gravy, nigga. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> I got enough meat right here. If that I shit was know. probably I fresh, you probably would have got some points, but nah. They still look better now. <laughs> Dang. I'm a pasta nigga. I want my shit to be cheesy, nigga. I know what that shit sound like when I stir it. I don't, but see, I, I don't think cheese is easy. To I me, want, cheese ain't the problem. That's what I said. There's, I bro, want, some want, old shit look like there's an ingredient <laughs> in there that just doesn't belong <laughs> in that bitch, bro. I don't know. You probably can't fatal see it, Chet. You know it's going to be fatal. No, fatal. No, you get it? <laughs> y'all, y'all see? Do y'all know what I'm talking about? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that attraction. I don't know. I'll probably eat. Traction to that porcelain. I'm just saying, I, look, all I know is when I stir that, it's gonna sound just like when I'm stirring that. Goddamn, uh-huh. and that's how I want that shit to be. Stirring that. Okay, I got one other side that. topic. I ain't yeah. about to hate on no motherfucker getting done, so you know what I'm saying? Kudos, bro. Touche. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That, 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 that was look, well eat, played, bro. You, you gotta eat the beat, nigga. Do it. Hey, you may well, die well played, bro. Damn. You know what I'm saying? Do your motherfucking thing, bro. Straight up. Okay, now we're gonna keep pulling up, though. I ain't never had no chicken ass. <laughs> Bro, okay, what I do got a question. Go ahead. Uh, so we asked hey, you, Ali, what's happening? We had this conversation before. If it's you were to walk into 7 Eleven and yeah. accidentally rub before Loco, <laughs> and I want to hear Archie answer. We gave him all right. <laughs> and a genie were to come out, and a genie is a musician artist. What genie is coming out of the Four Loco can? <laughs> Run that question by me one more fucking time. Go to the store. And you rub a four, four loco can, like a genie lamp. And a genie comes out that's a hip hop artist. No, oh, a musical, a musical artist. artist. Don't have to I, don't, I don't want no boxes. Yeah, no drawn. boxes. Just a, it's just an artist. An artist that you rub, you <laughs> know what I'm saying? Who you think? Who's your artist that coming out of the genie bottle? You know what? My motherfucker. <laughs> who's, co- who's coming Come out of the floor? Come on, no, man. You got somebody in your head, motherfucker. I see it. Let us know. Let us know who it is. I can see it right there. I can't name him because I can't see exactly, but it's blurry, motherfucker. Your forehead kind of covering it, but I see it coming through. This motherfucker be reading my forehead, bro. <laughs> who be reading my forehead, bro? <laughs> Damn. My shit Alexa big to be <laughs> Uh, Carlos Santana. <laughs> Damn, why Carlos Santana? Bro, because motherfuckers about to put some respect on that can. <laughs> Gotta respect it somehow. Nasty ass shit. Damn, <laughs> that egg machine said, ass, nasty <laughs> ass. Portia said DMX. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can see that. Your Dang. guts will be growling. <laughs> he gonna come out the hell. What? I ain't gonna lie. Mine's a soldier boy now. I'll change it. The soldier boy. <laughs> that ain't gonna come why out does that fit so damn <laughs> I don't know. He gonna come out with the right energy. Yeah. I'm the first motherfucker to be a genie in a four loco bottle. Like nigga, first motherfucker. Yeah, four loco. Yeah. First motherfucking rapper. Oh, oh damn shit. It. That shit. Why the fuck does that fit so well, bro? The I'm next sorry. one was Lil Pump, but yeah. And I said post. No sales. No sales. No sales. That's the accidental. Riff we actually riff rap a good one. 
Oh, yeah. That one's nah, right there. Nah, he said Post Malone, but I think Post Malone. I, nah, Riff Raff, Riff Raff I, is right there with Soldier Boy. That's a better fit than Post Malone. I, I, Post Malone I, I, is a Budweiser. If you rub a Budweiser <laughs> or a Bud Light, that nigga's popping out that bitch. I promise you. That nigga shit is beers and cigarettes. That nigga's oh, coming God. out that motherfucker. Uh, let's see. Boy Loco. Square. <laughs> shit, Joe Budden. <laughs> uh, 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 Damn. <laughs> the Joe Budden gonna come out the square pack. If you run some cigarettes, Joe Budden gonna come out that what about, Joel, <laughs> what about Joel Ortiz? Is the meeting gonna come out the other side? <laughs> coming out the Dos Equis. That's racist. <laughs> <laughs> Who's coming out the Dos Equis? <laughs> Joel Ortiz. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucked up, bro. Why? Nah, he's coming Damn. out of the, He's coming out of the Corona Familiar. <laughs> nah, nigga, Bukanas. <laughs> you yes. got the nigga love that shit, the oh, Bukanas, boy. They love the most. Boy, y'all, hell, you man. Yeah, boy. <laughs> 18-year-old male, man. Oh, Golly. yeah, this shit was lit. This shit was lit. Um, they got it under black excellence and shit like that, but Jalen Smith is the youngest. My, they, my <laughs> he man. looks greasy. <laughs> that motherfucker does look like a knight of four locos. He look greasy. <laughs> Hey, look, chill out on Michael Jackson. That nigga sipping something else. He ain't sipping for locos. That nigga sipping like some fucking he, <laughs> when it, Amsterdam or something. Got that nigga going, ho! Oh! <laughs> that, that boy sipping medicinal. <laughs> what the fuck yeah. is sipping medicinal? But he found a way, damn it, killed him. Some Jaylen, medical drink, goddammit. Jalen <laughs> Smith is the youngest black man in the U.S. Y'all caught that. The camera caught that shit. <laughs> Jalen Smith is the youngest black man in the U.S. at just 18 years old. And he is um, the, he is now the mayor of Earl, Arkansas. And I want to say he won the vote, 218 votes to 139. So, Damn! So granted, it's not a big, I guess. It's not a big, it's not, not, I'm saying it's not a big like place Damn. that he's like mayor of but still that's bro, a fucking accolade and, bro. I, bro, I, bro and the win bro he won against uh fucking nemi matthew senior has been working citizen in earl for over four decades come on now come on now get that geek bro give young nigga his props bro man you ain't never gonna get that old po- old folks smell out of that office it's gonna smell like mothballs shaggy and- carpet and mothballs man that motherfucker the mayor <laughs> that motherfucker the mayor hey, build a new one man, hold on. build a new one nah <laughs> hey y'all tax dollars <laughs> hey build shaggy a new carpet and mothballs and Chanel Yo, number five. <laughs> bro, I'm nice. telling you. But so, like, I love... Yeah, they for the scale, bro. People, the people scale, in the, you know, I like, I like going to comments because a lot of times them hoes be doing funny and shit. Yeah. But, and so you got, it's, 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 you got two sides to it. Go ahead. A lot of them are, he not old enough He to, beat the incumbent. To like, to know anything. You know what I'm saying? Like, he too young to, re- like, this nigga ain't even really got into life yet and he kind of helping dictate I others and shit is what niggas are saying. And then you know, on the other side is what basically what we saying, like, man, fuck that shit, do your thing. So anybody My, can just run? In certain areas, I, in certain places, they each, each, each. I, I disagree with the motherfuckers' thing. notion on that, that just because, see, this is, and this is that. Because if he was unfit, he would This is that, but this is that, this is that traditional, My, this is why I don't like tradition. You know what I'm saying? Because tradi- to me, I only care about tradition if it's a good thing. Yeah, Unless your tradition is a positive I fuck your tradition, like for real, fuck your, fuck your tradition. Just sacrifice you know tradition saying? for history, but, and we on the same page. Stop it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> but bro, you mean to tell me just because? How many times has a motherfucker done looked at us because of our age and the tried Arkansas? to downplay something, tried to yeah. down, and tried to the downplay Arkansas. something that we said? Or the point that we was making just because of our age and acting like that shit had no validity to it. Yeah. Yeah, we know good and damn well what we talking about. No, we accurate as fuck. Like, you mean to tell me just because he 18, he ain't fit? There's a lot of motherfuckers who are geniuses going to college who are 12 and shit. If, bro, if you able to get that far, that was awesome. you're good. You set up a campaign. He's, I mean, he's only like six years out. I done seen people who are in college <laughs> or fresh out of college and then get elected. People who I done went to school with get, you know what I'm saying, are now judges and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, that's not a... Ones I know that life is. But I'm, I, 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 bro, I'm against that shit, though, as far as people who knock him just trying to use his age give it, give him he time. not fit. Give him like, time. If, he, if, he, if he gets in and he start doing bullshit and trying to set up gaming there... He ain't any more, he ain't any more, uh... I mean, he ain't any more, uh, what you say, uh... 
fit for the job than anybody else going in there at any other age who ain't never had that fucking act. Fuck it, whether they had the job before the or not. Perfect, perfect we we hear these motherfuckers corrupt, being corrupt, and doing yeah, all kinds the, of funny the, shit. The perfect little comeback for a lot of the people that were saying that shit, they were like, fucking bro, politicians. We, we know 45-year-olds that can't cook or drive a car or do other shit, so mm-hmm. what age got I to work do with some. That's what I'm saying, so what age... Boy, don't even get me started. <laughs> like, nigga, I... Like, so what's uh-huh. the... The nigga triggered me again, goddamn. <laughs> <laughs> but it's like, age don't mean shit. It really if, don't. If he he said in his mind he wanted to run, he ran and won. At least yeah. see what the nigga got. At least. And, when it's and he won, and, it, bro, and that's the perfect way that he won by both. Yeah, the like, people did that, so it ain't like you could. Oh, he just no. The people, the people voted for him. That's, that's probably a lot of shit. And you know what's crazy? Every nigga that graduated with him voted for him. Another. Like, oh, that's that's what, I think. Oh, guy, eighteen now, we gonna vote. Now, I, I think now, you. now, like niggas was like, hey. hey. Follow that, me on Instagram like you get my works. But, hey, bro, and the U.S. The, I follow you back, bro. You got the U.S. government to gonna love that shit, though. It works. You, bro, for real, the U.S. government, you mean to tell me you got all these young motherfuckers to go out there and Disney? vote? Like, bro, they gonna eat that shit up. What, what, what we, we talking about it. Where, where the fuck are we? In yeah, Dallas. That, and that's, that's you know what, what I'm saying? saying? It's it's like, supposed to be being talked say, about everywhere now. Man, say, that motherfucker is on. I guarantee say, you he got money coming in already, getting flooded in look, by outside resources hey, right look, now. That motherfucker's made already. Hey, look, the 18-year-old, hey, he is fucking made oh, already. You talking about being in Texas and shit? I think you talking about Charleston you know I'm saying? White. He's known, though, bro. He ain't just some little small town. I don't know why. No, no, no. I was just saying, <laughs> look, the, the, the comment was like, I don't know about y'all, but I wouldn't want an 18-year-old to be my mayor. He was like, you don't even stay in Arkansas, nigga. Shut the fuck up. I'm like... Oh God, bitch, go vote for your town. Bitch. Seriously, bro. Mind your business. That, bro, that's some other shit. But hey, uh, damn it, I think who brought up office chairs? Which one of y'all brought up office chairs? The motherfucker who's in there paying the water bill. Uh, let's see here. Crystal, what's going on? Rubber dub dub and get Carlos Mencia. What the? Fuck? I ain't gonna lie. Michael Grady say rubber Corona, you get George Lopez, and that's hilarious as fuck. That's that's the racist one. That's the racist. One. <laughs> he says, "Is uh, it, uh, wait, hold on, that's not a, that's not a topic." <laughs> I, I, was, I was about to, I was about to go in. I was about to go in. Hey, you know he got a new show. Did you see that shit? Yeah. No, nah, we gotta watch that. Give me a Corona cycle rubber right now. We gotta watch that. I ain't gonna lie. What's that? Right the new George Lopez show. You about the one with him and his daughter? Yeah. Oh, actually, Lopez, I, I had. Lopez? The, Started, Lopez, bitch. No, no, I haven't, but I mean, people used to get on the old sitcom, but George Lopez shit was on some real shit. That's like, what I'm saying. That motherfucker like, be yeah, real as fuck. That's why I, I want to watch this shit. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Yeah. modern take on whatever he trying to talk about, I'm with it. Bro, oh, and, isn't that his real daughter, too? Is that Maybe, his real I daughter? Think, I think so, yeah. Like, bro, man, come on. That shit going to be fucking lit. Uh, office so, chairs. Volkswagen. Hold up. They have uh, developed an office chair that goes 12 miles an hour. That's fucking Yes, good. sir. That's fucking <laughs> yes, sir. Let's yes, sir. Immature, I'm sorry. I'm immature office as fuck on this one. I'm going in. No, I'm going to I'm going to Let's go. Bro, we're going to no, we gonna be understand. up in this. We're going to oh, be up in this bit. This nigga, he, this nigga, this nigga, like this nigga, he should just going to walk up in here. Me and this nigga Isaiah just going to be up in the bitch. And just <laughs> popping around this bitch. And if it ain't that, it's going to be my ass coming home from the fucking gym. And then these motherfuckers going to be up in here just all over this bitch. That shit going to be lit, bro. Hell yeah. Y'all don't, y'all don't understand. Come around the corner and shit. Y'all don't understand. Y'all said something about Vin Diesel? No. No, look. Y'all don't understand. Y'all don't understand. I work for Volkswagen. Y'all don't understand. Y'all don't understand. I work in a warehouse. In a big ass, a big ass warehouse. <laughs> with office chairs. With all types of obstacles and shit. Oh, we racing. Nigga, we yeah. racing in that bitch. Nigga, I know for a fact me and the other dispatchers in that shit. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to throw some shit back up, bitch. Oh, yeah. you need me to take something all the way to the other side of the I'm building. never walking in that hole, nigga. I'm saying less. Bro. <laughs> oh, we got something in my car. Hold on. <laughs> hey, I'm looking just like that. I'm me on the... <laughs> 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 Be like the evil motherfucker who pull up and shit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, hey, look, I'm gonna, go, hey, look, I'm gonna go get the stray cat off who the fucking fuck, platform. Why the fuck didn't that you clock out for your lunch? <laughs> oh, God, look, they gonna come in. They gonna try to get him off. What you got, the Stephen Hawkins edition? <laughs> hey, nah, look. When they come in, look. <laughs> what the when fuck? They come, when they come in to return their bags, I'm gonna be in my shit like this, right? 
I'm gonna be turned around. They're gonna come in and return their bag. I'm gonna just flip that bitch around. I've been waiting on you. <laughs> I've been waiting for you. Bitch, we know. Nigga, you dispatching. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> like, take this bag. Shut the fuck up. Did you say you put what on that bitch? Train horn on that motherfucker. Bro, can't ride that bitch in traffic. Ride through that motherfucker. Nah, through the nigga, when he said train, I'm thinking like, of connecting multiple bitches. We going on a ride. I can see it. I can see he with that bitch pulling up. Old bitch taking forever to get out. Just honking that hoe. And <laughs> hurry up and move the fuck out the way. Like Move your ass out like people, the fucking like way. Like, people that be driving their wheelchairs on the road, because they be hitting that hoe. That nigga Tony used to do that shit. He be going to the store and shit, and that nigga, da, 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 like that. The nigga with the one cute. leg will love that chair. <laughs> Ah. I asked, bro, no <laughs> lie. And his cousin in the Grove. Oh, God. <laughs> hey, Archie, I swear to God. He was telling me about that nigga. And then, like, a couple hours later, I see a nigga on a bike with the feather. I said his name, him. He said, nah, that's his cousin. That's his cousin. That can't be him. He ain't no way he got from out here over there that fast, fam. Hey, bro, that, this motherfucker a regular now. I just saw this. That one leg, though. That nigga, she strong. <laughs> that one <laughs> But bro, this motherfucker is a miracle, though, bro. Because this motherfucker be moving, though. Like, this motherfucker be moving. Like, I be like, bro, like. Hell. Hey, bro. Hell's going to have a fun party, bro. I ain't tripping. Fuck, All the little niggas going to hell. Daniel White and Joe Rogan. All the little niggas in the drugs going to hell, so fuck it. This motherfucker brought up Dana White and Joe Rogan. They must have done did something. Yeah. All right, so look, who y'all want to start with? Y'all want to start with Dana Joe White and Joe Rogan. We're going to end with Joe Rogan. Oh, hold on. Go, 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 go. Joe Rogan. All right, he want to start with Joe Rogan. All right, Paul. Right. <laughs> Joe Rogan accuses The Rock of faking steroids. <laughs> Joe Rogan <laughs> has publicly accused Dwayne Johnson of uh, steroids on his podcast Sunday. Joe went on the er- and he and he urged him to come clean to the public on whether he was on steroids or not, and said, "There's no way you can look like that in your 40s, and you should just let your fans know because they deserve to know the truth." I mean, I don't think that's really a secret. I mean, I mean WWE and, shit right there. That's what make them. That's what you say, right? <laughs> no, nah, no, nah, no. Nah, I ain't saying WWE. Once he got out. WWE and he started once he wasn't wrestling no more and he's just he a civilian make what that's my point he's but like, I mean I like, watch this nigga who, on Instagram what, what, it's not illegal for him to that it was no but I'm talking about the people who tripping though. that and you know he's not selling like, niggas workout programs and exactly other shit. you know what I'm saying that so would be like, the issue even, if he trying to like you can get big like this and then you like did Joe you Joe right he must have woke up mad or something this one I don't know but I don't know bro because honestly I don't even care and on like I mean does his movies go hard actually no actually fuck that I'm on the rock side. You just a fucking hater, Joe Rogan, because one, do you not like know what Samoans are? And hold on, and he gonna say hey, he, ain't nobody can't look like that in their forties? Yeah. Shit. Come holler at me when I'm in my forties. Nigga, look Real at Real shit. If especially if I'm especially if I bro, like for going at the rate that I'm going right now, come holler at me in my freaking forties while I'm saying fuck y'all talking about pterodactyl shit. I was getting ready to say. I was waiting for the side. He's out big bird now. Big bird now. He's out a big bird now, bitch. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, bro, I ain't saying, gonna. I'm a Thanksgiving turkey now. Uh, bitch. My, my shit, go, my, like, my shit my gonna breasts. be fucking. My shit gonna be right though, You're because be a dragon even, but my, like, I already, nah, fuck, bro, go ahead. ahead. Do you not know what the fuck a Samoan is, bro? The motherfuckers are something. The motherfuckers are unreal. Like they're they're like unicorns, bro. They that's how like, they, they like real, that. Bro. They like, go be nigga. Them niggas are seventy nine and big as fuck. They jump not, off of cliffs really barefoot, bro. It's the rice and they're fish. really. Like it's not even, but they're still strong. But, but, and them but, same ones can still strong. climb no, but, cliffs, but, but, bare feet, and jump off the road. Like them motherfuckers are raw, bro. Like, 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 like you said, they big in general and still so athletic, if, bro. And will race nigga, you bare feet, run. Like I follow The Rock on Instagram because niggas motivational as fuck. Say Instagram. his workout routines don't be off. There's not a day. On that bitch that he's not saying, oh, it's time to run. Nigga, it's three in the morning, bitch, go to sleep. Like, fuck. He is nigga, like Kobe nigga, when nigga, it comes nigga, to say, workouts, nigga, bro. Nigga, bleeding and shit. Mm, I love it. Uh, he get going. You got 60 on there? Yeah. Nigga ain't got that shit, nigga. Bro, you can't. No, bro. That nigga works out 24-7. I'm sorry. You uh, got this. Uh, his... Uh, even his cheat days, he working out. And that shit, that, and, that, and that real shit, that shit, be, that shit be offensive. 
to motherfuckers who really put in that work. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Now, granted, I, uh, now I did just say there has been that rumor going out there that he has, you know what I'm saying, been on him for a while. So it ain't like Joe Rogan just broke a new rumor right. there on that. But at the same time, no, he that shit, that shit, that, you say what? He got hooked up and him and Mark Wahlberg started that movie. I, I'm not, I'm saying, I, don't, I wouldn't be surprised with him working out and doing yeah, his thing. And like with him, with him, with, bro, with, it, with, with you taking him off of his WWE yeah. schedule and having to put that time into working out and just doing movies, I could see how a motherfucker could actually be that fucking big and active if that's all you doing. You know what I'm saying? So, and that's disrespectful as fuck to be putting in all that fucking work. Ask John Cena. That, he used to get the biggest, oh man, get this steroid machine. He told Vince McMahon, like, straight up, bro, like, that shit disrespectful, saying, bro. Like, the motherfuckers who do that man. shit legit, like that. that saying, like that, that shit weird, weird, bro. And when you that nigga whole history, bro, he's been Pain, he Pain and Game right. was a good yeah, movie Pain though. That shit went hard. Yeah, that shit that shit went that shit went hard. Y'all know who the Liver King is? Yeah. Y'all, oh, and y'all that, know he just got exposed right now, like a week ago. His uh his uh emails with his doctor about his steroids just came out. This nigga's been lying ever since he came out talking and about all I do is eat raw liver and, that's and how I got bone marrow. That's and that's I'm, living like, I'm living like back in the day how we're supposed to live off the land, this, that, and the and third. This is how I'm barefoot. He's a bare... He built yeah. the shit. Ain't yeah, got he, no legs. It looked like he missed leg day, but all this is there. Yeah, no, nah, he swallowed up that guy a beard and shit yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah bro. Bro. And it's like, and I way. could, bro, I could tell just as soon as I looked at him, bro. I was like, there ain't no way you just eat that and you get like that, bro. That's who needs to be mad. That's who needs to be. He's selling shit. He's trying to get people to believe that you can do and actually be built like this naturally. Gonna eat raw no, you don't get liver poison liver. and shit you like that. Raw you, fucking you're not giving no workout programs. Fucking the rock, animal the testicles. The rock gonna give you a the real shit portion. The rock gonna danger give you a, fear with the disrespect. An actual program. The rock gonna tell you eat a big ass set. plate of spaghetti. Not even nigga. that. No, not even that. Go fuck, hard. Fuck the food shit. Just when it comes to steroids, he go tell you, all right, look, these are the workouts I do. These are what you need to do. Four by fours of this. This by this by this. This by this by this. this. He gave you his whole fucking workout routine. And ain't none of that shit is the reason why he got to where the fuck he at. And so it's like, you niggas talking about steroids and shit when this nigga right here ain't giving you no workout routine, ain't giving you nothing, just saying eat liver and you'll get big. Y'all mad at the rock, man, say Man, all he doing is giving you badass Joe Rogan, wrong people. Joe, nah, Ro- Joe Rogan, shut your hate hey, ass up. You mad because you feel like a blog right now. You gave me a workout routine and one did it. Who are you mad at? I think. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> and like, bro, shut your mean egghead built ass up. Nigga, you just mad because you. Like that Sonic he just called him Dr. Robot. <laughs> Pull up. Hey, I actually might want, at the end of this bitch, I'm giving a review because I finished that game. Uh, Y'all saw me. I don't know who was fucking here. I think one of the new sisters was here. Uh, anyway, Dana White has called football the least talented sport on earth, referring to football? soccer. Okay, okay. He's referring to soccer. He had to say football. I said that's what I said like that, but he, he and he's and he wait what? Hold on, he said what? They still a fucking dumbass. Dana, Dana White, White said shows what? His dice. White slammed football, soccer for Americans, but we know what they're talking about. In a recent interview, calling it the least talented sport on earth, a Four game, years. a game for three year olds, and that he simply can't stand. Is he, talking about, is he talking about? Is he talking about? Is he talking about American soccer? You talking about soccer? Nigga, soccer. Soccer period. Soccer. Soccer. American soccer is regular, nigga. What the fuck? But the American, no, but say, American, soccer, soccer, American like soccer is American, American soccer. soccer. Oh, like our soccer like, team? We, we compared to the American team? Yeah, yeah. But, but now nah, he's talking about the whole sport. It's a three-year-old Look, sport. I want to see him get his fuck him. First, I'm. I want to see him make a goal with all these motherfuckers out here running around trying to get their health. Fuck all that shit. I want him to try to make a header. From any place, I want him to try to make that bitch from five feet in front of the fucking goal. You know, what? give him a free kick with a goalie and see if he, he fucking do that. Like it's a lot. Of, I like, want. I want. Him, I want him to. Goalie. I want him to try to take the ball from uh, just a pro nigga from Dallas M. You know what I'm saying? Like I want him to. You ain't even got. It ain't gotta be no top nigga. Ain't gotta be messy. None of them niggas. Just an actual pro. I want him to try to take the ball from that nigga. Without without fouling, bro. This is why, and this is why you got all these little minions and motherfuckers on social media who they just love to talk shit about everything and sit back because they sit back and okay, we know it's World Cup time and that's all everybody talking about. So somebody got to come in there and be the one who man fuck this World Cup shit. Ain't nobody watching that. They gonna keep doing that because they keep seeing because they keep seeing these because they keep seeing these big major motherfuckers doing the same thing, bro. There's a reason. Soccer is what the most popular sport in the world. 
the most popular sport in the fucking world and number it's also one of the most physical sports in the fucking world before the CTE mm-hmm. shit came out and the bro most accessible bro I'm saying most accessible has done had some of the most fucking concussions you know what I'm saying your stamina got to be through the fucking roof is played all kinds of different fucking ways. Your hand and eye coordination is so fucking legit to the point where they say you got a fucking advantage to motherfuckers who do that and then go straight to fucking basketball, i.e. Steve fucking Nash, a Hall of fucking Famer, who was on the fucking team. Like, bro, you got me all the way fucked up when yeah, it comes to soccer, bro. You got me all the way fucked up when it comes to soccer, bro. It don't take, it don't take no, it don't take no fucking skill. Bro, what the fuck? And when it comes to that skill thing, a lot of people argue. If you got any type of athleticism, you can go and master it. Let me tell you this. No. Because I'm way more athletic than a lot of motherfuckers I play soccer with. Let me tell you, they cook the fuck out of my ass all the time. I could go slide and get the ball out the way every so often. But nigga, the one my nigga Eddie that nigga, right, my, my, my nigga my Guatemalan partner, that, hey, that nigga used to cook the fuck out of me. His whole Triple, fucking yeah. family used to cook our ass, nigga. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Bam, I'm sitting there like fam. Making that shit look like, easy, fam, dog. On, on concrete and shit. Like, bro, no. You can't sit here and tell me that there ain't no skill to that bitch. You go, tr- nigga, bounce a, fuck it. All the fucking soccer on the field shit, nigga. Bounce a knee, I mean, bounce a ball on your knee 20 times in a row. Fuck it. Five times in a row. Nigga, three times in a row, nigga. <laughs> like, matter of fact, your knee or your foot. Like, Either nah, or. Nigga. Knee, foot, any part on your body. And make it stay there, motherfucker. Don't be following that bitch Jeez. around. Just sit there and do it. Yeah. Back to that. That nigga. Man, them niggas can just sit here and do this shit. The whole podcast, they can kick that bitch up and just play this. You know what I'm saying? Do this shit. And you know what? Soccer is the only fucking sport. What? Don't take no soccer fucking skill and fight, Soccer is the, the, soccer is the only fuck. Soccer is the only sport where motherfuckers get hyped when you almost do some shit. Bro, you don't even do it. Nigga, you almost nigga. you almost score a goal and motherfuckers Bro, in that bitch hype and you get a nigga, replay. How is, how, how is this the most angry? How is this the best sport on the planet? And I don't think any game has went past five. Nigga, you know what the fuck I mean. Soccer, nigga, them hoes is one, two, three, two. What, nigga, them hoes be smart. Like, the, we don't care about the score. Football, we care about the score. Basketball, we care about the score. Soccer's yeah, emotional, bro. It's athletic and it's emotional, no, bro. You, but you get my point. I'm saying, they typically, it's not like high school. I'm saying, I was planning on playing niggas. FIFA tonight, though, really, though, because I'm in FIFA mode. Like, you remember I'm, when they had the World Cup and they had Nigeria versus England? I got, uh, yeah. What's up? What'd you say? Nigeria versus England. What about Nigeria? Oh, no, my, my bad. It's Nigeria versus Germany. What about, what about it? it? We lost four. They couldn't have the, the letters up. Oh, Nigeria. Because <laughs> G E R N I G. Just like how Sweden is Sweden and Sweden and Denmark, every time they play, it's always going to be Sweden. So it's like. Oh, you know, <laughs> shit. So yeah, you can't put that. Damn. They, I think they put, the, they put the whole name. They put, they put all of Niger and yeah. then just Germ. Like just just the Germany thing. Yeah, they better. <laughs> <laughs> that was smart. That, that was nigga, smart. That nigga group. Because boy, boy, so. Twitter, every social media oh, would have. I forgot what team it was, but England would had a fucking. They were having a, a moment of silence for the Queen. Oh. And I'm no, it wasn't the, England. That was the Irish. Was that the That's, Irish? And they hate they hate the Queen. And nigga, they were talking about putting that bitch in a box. Nah, so, right. so it was the Irish and, and the England, right? They were playing or something. And then, like, there was a moment of silence. And somebody on one side said something. Like, you could hear it. Somebody said, shut. Bro, somebody said something about fuck the queen or fuck something. Oh, Boy, soccer, all you oh, hear is all these niggas. Shit, fuck you, nigga. The whole sideline, like, the whole stadium. Oh, no. So- warm, soccer bro. field, soccer field to this day. There are still, hell, I guarantee you, if I tell you, if I go to my phone right now, I can find you where there was a recent soccer ride at a stadium. Like, these mother, they, they fight, bro. Yeah, that's Like, shit. They, they fight and they care about their shit to the point where, this man, Butler, say 90 Lizzie minutes and, and box, extra time on the soccer field. Uh. Butler, I'm glad you brought that up because not only is it 90 minutes plus extra time, you got... Not everybody gets fucking subbed out. Yeah, in soccer, actually. you only get three subs. Yeah. Unless it's like a meaningless game, like an exhibition or something like that. In soccer, you only get three fucking substitutions. So majority of your team is on the field for the whole damn game. Unless you sub in half the team. Your goalie is... Right. Unless, you, like, unless you sub half the team, bring them in and sub, then sub. Like, unless you got a good strategic game plan, but like you said, most of them don't. Like the goalie... Damn near never comes off the field. Never bro. comes out. Never and, and that, a lot that, of defenders. Damn near never come off the field. And even some of your best forwards and shit. 
damn near never come off the field. So, no, nah, you're right. Like, bro, that shit is fucking that's that, athletic that's as hell. If, if we want to talk about what don't take skill, fighting. Like, like, yeah. What? You, like, in reality, bro, especially UFC, they just, nigga, you take a nigga to the ground and beat the fuck out of him. Like, granted, yes, there's different techniques and all that extra shit, but at the end of the day, you could brute force that shit. Compared you may not to, like it, bro, but you, it's possible. Would you compare that to Aaron Rodgers throwing a ball through a small ass hole from fifty yards away, or somebody in the UFC ring? Like, which one do you think would, is a harder talent? Or not? Fuck football. Let's talk it soccer. Okay, Let's keep it soccer. Fighting a nigga, which every person on the planet can do, or everybody can having fight. to kick the ball to the fucking it's not corner about post. Fighting, it's about winning. Everybody can fight. Whether you a bitch or not is up to you. Everybody can fight. Yeah, true, true. Cause I don't care if the person takes an L in the UFC ring, I still got respect for them. Just like in boxing, whether you take a dub or an L, you got my respect just for stepping your ass in, in there. The ring. That, like that's real life, top. you fight, you that's fight. That's off top. Out Soccer nigga, how many people can kick a goal kick and make it go in? A corner kick and make bro, it go in. Bro, you get in. your ass, bro. Let your yeah. ass be going, bro, and you go to kick oh, and that sorry. shit go. Yeah, that's that's a big ass goal. Your ass, bro, if your <laughs> ass, no, bro. And so if you miss a goal, like let's say you go to kick and your shit is like wide left or wide right, yeah. you think motherfuckers get mad about that shit in football on a field goal? Shit in soccer, you about to get your ass torched. Oh, yeah, you about nah, to get your I, ass torched. I would, I would argue with, especially if a nigga try to say this type of shit, I'm straight up gonna say nigga fighting take way less talent than any of these sports. Period. I what you saying. got, Kevin? Kevin want to speak on? I can tell. He thinking. That's what I'm saying. He, his I'm mind thinking, working. His I'm gear like, is turning. He's trying to get the comeback. I want to say no. That's not true. It's an anger management sport, bro. I mean, because at the end of the day, I feel like you train. These niggas have anger issues. But just I mean, like, yeah, you got brute power, but brute power don't always win. But don't, you know, but, but you know what wins? It's a higher possibility. Saying, you know what wins saying, in fighting? Mean, nigga with endurance, you know, because the soccer always is gonna win because I got endurance. And that's not. No, always. I didn't say he, you know I'm what, not saying no, always. No, no, no I'm, I'm just, you. I'm just saying. I'm but just you know saying. what wins? But you know what wins in fighting? What gives people the advantage in fighting? The same thing that gives people the advantage in soccer: reflexes, yeah. hand-eye coordination. That over there, sta- like, all the shit, stamina. All the shit is translatable. It's the now, same, which one same. uses more? Me personally, fucking what's call it? Because with humans, you can always almost. You don't always have the ball. Exactly. You're not always running. Yes, you. Yes, you are. You, even sometimes when it doesn't look like it, like. No, okay, but I get that. But y'all are not. You're not running full sprint or at least jogging speed. That's true, but even in boxing, I mean, they're not you, sitting there swinging the whole work. time either. They're but, sitting there, okay, they're grabbing, they're, they're clinching, jogging. they're back, no, back, they're not. walking, they're up against the road. They, they actually get, you get shit. more breaks in boxing. And fighting and shit. Oh, God, no. You got 90 yes. minutes. Yes. Oh. Bro, how many, you go what, they, how many, they go what, three minutes? How many, how many round, how many yeah, minutes is it in boxing for three minutes? They just give them three, y'all. Let's get three. three. Minute rounds. We'll even stretch and go both. Okay, so, so yeah, bam. But one's way more physical than the other. Okay, but how many? Okay, but how many times when they pull their cards up? How many? Okay, yes, no, but hold on. Okay, but when they but when they pull it up, how many times? Directly, you right, but you how many box? How many boxers land more than they miss? How many boxers land more than they miss in boxing? And because when I, I'm not, I'm not, I ain't, I'm not gonna sit here in front like I'm a big boxing expert because I'm not. I ain't, like boxing is kind of falling off for me as of late. It, you know what I'm saying it's just. No, starting I mean to, he said UFC, not even that. No, but, so but even, now but look, even it, when you fight, you also have the opportunity to defend yourself at all times. They don't. They not even finna keep the fight going if you can't defend yourself. Right, and so, when with, go ahead. with the opportunity to defend yourself at all times. Yeah, niggas getting kicked. In soccer, you ain't seeing everybody that's potentially fucking you up. You could be looking at one person, but somebody behind you could uh, accidentally just fuck you up and tell your shit. You know <laughs> just accidentally. No, I get fuck that part. Up. I just. <laughs> Yeah, so, I so I, I, I get, I would, that's what I'm saying. Just for a nigga like Dana White, I'm gonna argue that that shit. You know, this ain't for us because we don't give a fuck. We ain't sitting here trying to say that you, the soccer right. is a suck. You know what I'm saying? Right. For a nigga like that, I'm gonna argue like, nah, nigga, you tripping? Super tripping. I like football better. Football or football? Foot, American, <laughs> fucking you. Field goes and touchdowns. Football. Southern sport, ba- bald eagles and shotgun, yeah. <laughs> Billy, give me two of them right now. Just, just threw that a Troy Aikman eight, goddamn it. <laughs> That's why I said give me two of them right now. We need two more. 
Uh, but yeah, that was them saying outlandish shit. Yeah, but that session just rubs me the wrong fucking. Like, what the fuck got in the UFC today? <laughs> like, what, what what tickled their knickers this past week? Like, why these niggas? Their broke? what? It tickled their knickers. <laughs> Oh, don't say that too hard. Watch that Madea. Don't say that five times fast. Madea, so. I got Marvel written down here, though. Pull up. Oh, you oh. ever seen that Madea? That white lady said something about some hickers? I stopped watching Mer- Madea movies. She was from England. She said, did she just call me a yuk? Oh, that's, I, think that, I think that's, yeah. Yuk? <laughs> yeah, I know you're talking That's when they brought him in. I don't think that was, uh. Yeah, uh, somebody family. What's, what's the shit? Was, uh, that, the was, uh, was, yeah, that, yeah, was that the one with Eugene? Was that the one with Eugene Levy in it, though? The dude from the white dude from America? Yeah, with his protection. Medea's with his protection. I think that was that Yeah, for sure. For sure. Right, so, no, it wasn't that one. Yes, it was. It was a new one. It was that somebody was... was getting married, and uh, his family came into town. Nick. And it was a grandma. She was from, like, Ireland or some shit. Then it probably... Nigga, This was, I'm like, recently. Sure. Like, I know, house, nigga. Witness dropped... protection was recent, nigga. You thinking it's too far. We in 2022. So shit that dropped in 2016. No, this shit, like, dropped this fuck? year, fam. I guarantee you. They, you that would mean... Then fuck it. I'm really not watching that hoe, because he reusing the same jokes. <laughs> that nigga used that shit in the witness he protection. Said, there what? <laughs> yeah, that's what he he reused the same joke. So if he put that bitch in a new one, I'm not watching that shit. Uh, but Marvel Studios is reportedly reevaluating its release lineup for phases five and six, basically going for a quality over quantity approach. Now we are all people that are fans of Marvel, and we are all people that have I. I'm going to speak to myself at this point now. <laughs> I have enjoyed, because I don't know about them. I've enjoyed every fucking piece of content they've dropped since fucking Endgame. And that's pretty much what people are talking about. Or Spider-Man Far From Home, which was in the last one of Phase 4. I've enjoyed all of that shit. I ain't got no issues. All the series, all the movies, all that shit. I ain't got no issues. I don't think that they dropping, like the shit that they putting out is low quality. Unless we talking about certain CGI aspects. Then I think that they skimping on the money sometimes. But as much as I didn't want to like Black Panther, bitch was good. Mm. Thor, bitch was good. Well, ask Dr. Yeah. Umar. I but see, but I th- and I, fucking hates Black Panther. I don't think the quality's necessarily down on the stuff that they're putting out, but they're not I just motherfucker do need a time to breathe though. You know what I'm saying? I can like see I don't mind them taking more gaps in between the stuff that they're releasing. Now, when it comes to TV series and shit like that, I'm not throwing that in. You know what I'm yeah, saying? What you do on Disney Plus with TV series, that's well, complete. People, that's, what, that's, that's, what, complete. that's what's giving people the fatigue because the series go into the movies and they don't like that. Why? Quit being a bitch. I'm with you, but that's what they want. Okay, like. but that's okay, but okay, so they want to do it with, they don't want to do it with, but for. see, this is motherfuckers being picky I'm, because I'm with you. they Be being, careful what you they, wish because for. they I'm being, they, because now they being picky. But what do you mean? That's that's what they did with the comics. So now, oh, what, now, oh I don't want to watch this and have it carry over to the movies. So the no, but you matter. want, no, but what, you wanted the comics to carry over and get kids. It's like, nah, don't start that fucking discussion because now <laughs> at, you the fanboy, exactly, you about to be very hypocritical and look very, very dumb saying some shit like that. So nah, that don't go together. Sorry, I don't buy it. We don't want any. Slam the door in their face. Not buying yeah, any. Uh, yeah. So I do, I do want them to kind of give us better movies. Not saying what they got is bad, but I don't think they gave us another Iron Man yet. Like Iron Man 1. You know what I'm saying? Like when it comes to like classic. Like, and granted, they don't have to. They just dropped Endgame in fucking, what, 2019, I think? Or whatever fuck year that was. Because he typically, he was really like the launch character of it. Like he came like, in, got it I mean. established, like, and then he went into team about, shit. Like that, that movie is just the staple. You know what I'm saying? It's a good introduction. It stands alone. It's this, that, and the other. You don't have to watch nothing else, but... After watching that and watching Avengers, you're like, oh, shit, it all fits together. So it's like, I guess I do want to see another, like, give me something that's like, fuck, nigga, this in your face. You go, everybody going to love, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, they don't have to try, they, they too big. They don't have to try to appease to everybody no more. Like, shit, appease to the fans that fuck with you. And if niggas is tired, they can take a break. Because people back, was complaining. They've been complaining the whole time. You see what I'm saying? When niggas yeah. leave and take their break, like Family Guy and shit, yeah. when you come back, got hella content you to watch, content, motherfucker. Like you can't complain is. and say, oh, you ain't drop shit. Cause you, you, you can't make niggas happy. Watching. You can't make niggas happy. Because if they don't drop shit, like, that's what's going to, like, that's really Give me a Marvel movie that dropped that motherfuckers didn't complain about. That's the, that ain't one. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> exactly. Like, because like once, <laughs> once they slow down on how much they dropping, they're going to be like, 
Oh my god, I'm going through Marvel, uh, what the fuck is Marvel withdrawal. I haven't I'm had having, a Marvel movie I'm having three to play years. the games and watch the old shit to get like, through bro, and shit. you niggas can't be pleased, fam, so I, that's why I'm And I, them be the I ones I don't, I don't, I don't so, we don't listen to y'all. So fuck to, y'all. So to the Good Morning America shit earlier, I don't think businesses should take that shit into account at all. Now, granted, it's bottom line, bottom line, but talk. Oh, they're not going to like this. Nigga, they don't know what they like. Put the shit out. Fuck them. And people say yeah, Vince McMahon is evil for doing it. Now these motherfuckers don't know what they want. I'm going to tell them what the fuck they want. This is my show. Wow. My show, Run that shit. Good morning, like America. I, I'm a firm believer. If you don't like it, leave. Change the channel. <laughs> you, nigga, you, even if you pay for the ticket, walk out. They ain't going to tell you you can't go sit in another movie unless you want somebody else to see. Speaking of, what y'all been sipping? Without remorse, nigga. I just watched that shit with Michael B. Oh, Jordan and Tom Clancy shit. And I, then I Google because I do my fucking looks up after shit like that. And they setting up a whole Rainbow Six type of thing going on with that shit. Like, yeah. that was the spark off for a Tom Clancy universe and shit. Mm-hmm. Nigga, we are in for some shit. Okay. Hold we on. are in for some shit. That I, was a good I ass like movie. That movie. That was, I didn't think that movie was going to be that good. Because his was, wife was pregnant with nigga, his Nigga, I, I, I was sitting like that whole time. I was like, they had him fucked up. What the fuck? Damn. And that nigga, hey, he a badass. John Kelly, I ain't even, I ain't too much into the Tom the Clancy series. The new Elf on the show. But I, apparently that's the, like one of the most notable niggas What would that smell Clancy? like? Like car leather? Portia with these questions like a, a diesel on a treasel? <laughs> she say that Vin Diesel with a but this is killing her. Like she is still <laughs> on it. Like she is not letting that go. Like that shit, she just, she, just, she has to wrap her mind around uh, it. We gonna get on Willow. I know that we gotta get on Willow. For I gotta sure. watch the movie first so I can know what the fuck's going on. For sure. Do we have stars? No, we have to get stars from someone. If you have stars and you wanna donate it to the Kool Aid so we can talk about something you like, let us know so we can oh, watch uh, that shit. Not well, gonna lie. Give me, give I also, me, give me story. I ain't gonna lie. Give it to us. I wanna watch Spider Man. <coughs> and they and they the only niggas that got it. I think. Spider Man. All of them. I wanna watch all of them. What you niggas been on? I just finished binging The Mandalorian. I rewatched season one so I can catch back up. Finished season two and watch Boba Fett. Nigga said, you said, nigga, that shit hard, bro. <laughs> the book of Boba Fett. So you liked it. A lot of people didn't like it. How the fuck did you not like it? Because they wanted him to be more badass. They wanted Boba Fett to be more badass. They wanted him to be young Boba Fett. Boba Fett was old, bitch. They they want they wanted to see the Boba Fett. They wanted that was to break the classic nigga that only had three lines and made everybody love him. Can't be twenty five forever. My thing is, bitch, go watch the Mandalorian. You want a badass Boba Fett? Go watch the Mandalorian. I I can take one. I can. I can you hear me, me that nigga? That nigga say, either way, bitch, you're coming, you're coming with me. With me. <laughs> like That was like the Chris Hansen, I like you and I want you. <laughs> it's going to be the easy way. So it's like, nah, I, I, way. I, I, I didn't agree. I, I, I was with you because I, I enjoyed how they brought back the legend uh, lore. Kate of Bane. Bane. I like how they. Bane Live was fucking lit. I like how they did that. I like seeing Ahsoka Tano. Mm-hmm. Like, the fact that they incorporated a lot of shit from the animated. Now, I, mean, I mean, granted, it was all Star Wars lore, but you haven't seen them live action. Live action. You only like see Ahsoka, them animated. Like Ahsoka ain't technically canon because we ain't seen her in no movies and shit. So they like, oh, they just retconned her in and shit. But nah, bitch, she live action now. Tell them she's like that. And they explained why she wasn't in the movies, motherfucker. So now what you gonna say? Yeah, so yeah I'm, but I'm they with... explained because in, in the animated, the bitch saying. was trapped in motherfucking time. That's what I'm saying. I'm so with you. Like, so like, uh, I'm with and you. I like how they use all of that as backstory for Boba Fett. And I also like the fact that Boba Fett didn't have an episode. Like, one episode was fucking Mandalorian. Straight Mandalorian. People hated that shit. They was like, it's the These Boba. niggas Bro. can't. And that's a prime example. Just put out your content of what the fuck you want to put out. And let the people enjoy. Seriously, because you can't, you can't, you ain't gonna feel it. Like, it's the book of Boba. Not, it's already not, short. Bro. Why did you take him out of an episode of his own series? That was what they said. That's what they said. Why the fuck said. you still watching? Shut the fuck tell you, up. I was then. happy as fuck to see. I almost said Groot. Grogu, Grogu come back. Ahsoka. But with the with the chain on, so I'm all like, Luke, use a whole bitch you ass say- nigga for making that nigga pick. 
You could have just gave him both and be long live the force with the Jedi, with the sword, with the protection from the Mandalorian. But no, I gotta be a whole bitch ass nigga and make the nigga pick like Pokemon. I ain't gonna lie. Man, that shit pissed me off. And that and and, and I I'm hate sorry. I hate how they doing he it. He went Luke's a heel. I hate how they doing it because they making it fit to how he is in the sequel series. Like that nigga's an asshole hermit, bro. Like he he he's that type of dude, which is like he's jaded almost. And it's like, damn, that's not the Luke we knew. But when they give us that type of shit, it's like, bitch, you gotta choose. It's like, bitch, nigga, we loved you in the fucking movies and shit. You was always right, but right now, now you bitch, a whole you ass a, oh, God, nigga, yeah. you turned to a whole, whole ass. You the strongest nigga in the universe right now. You a whole ho, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> like, I ain't fucking playing with you right now. Hope so that's you. Yo, you're gonna see dude. Luke no more for a while. Mm-hmm. So are we gonna, you think we would get a Luke series? No, nah, we can't. Uh, nah. I, so can't they, they could do it if they use Sebastian Stan, the nigga who played Bucky uh, in the Marvel shit, because he looked just like that nigga fucking Mark Hamill, I would like bro. to see either a Luke series. That's gonna be hard to give up, though. Or I would like to see a Darth Vader series. Now, Vader series is very possible, and that's what I mean is this Vader going around fucking shit. Vader would be yeah, better, Vader but prime, yeah. Nigga, yeah. I feel like, I feel like, uh, hey, Skywalker don't need anything. He got enough movies right. and shit to tell that tells his story and what Luke. he needs. Luke, yeah. Luke doesn't need. The thing is, we have so much space in between. That's why they fucked up with the sequel series and making him so fucking old in there. Like, cool. I like the fact that y'all used all the original cast. That's great. I like that y'all aged them up, so we kind of had to. If you're gonna use the original cast, then you gotta age. You want to know what happened in between? Boom. And that, that but that's basically what he's saying about Darth Vader too. Like, I want to see when that nigga what. What did he do to make the galaxy fear his ass? You see what I'm saying? And in the comics, nigga, boy, that nigga did shit. That would be a nice bad that, And even Luke. Luke got hella comics. Like, the, like see, you Marvel could court, the, the instead of then Instead of giving them, the separating them, Vader series could be Vader and Luke's story just thrown the in the one fucking like, season. Boom! I'm with it. Boom. I'm with it. Uh, just like that. Tano, now that bitch. They did that with the Soka Tano and, uh... She get all show though. No, no, but you know what I'm talking about the Disney short I told you to watch that came out. Kanduku. Well, Count Dooku. They both they came out at the same they told, time. They told, like they told half the episode was her, half the episode was him. I ain't and saying I, no, but I'm not, yeah, but I'm, I'm not even saying half of it needs to be like he's saying tell the Skywalker or, story yeah, yeah. about both about Vader's rise and Luke's like, and right, but but you I guess how seen you, Luke's I'll rise. Say, but I guess how you would not, nah, but it, we talking about that extra time. What how I would go about it? Is why you would, it, huh, it would have to be a Luke story mainly, because that's the current time we in. You know what I'm saying? We already seen the movie Vader died and shit. So what they would do is do the like Sebastian Stan version of Luke and go about that. But as they do it and showing his arc through shit, also show Vader's arc and how they inversely related and how they become indifferent. Uh, That'd be fresh. That gives you a reason to have those flashbacks and tell those other exactly. stories and do okay, that okay, shit. Okay, 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 okay. That'd be fire, bro. Me, I've been sipping and I've been telling him about it. Uh, I went back. I've been going back and rewatching Black Lagoon, bro. Like What's Black Lagoon. It's an anime. Okay, um, okay. bro. I'm telling you, bro. I've seen it. I've, I ain't yeah. seen it, but I've heard of it. I robot. Know. Bad, it, bro. I tell you, when I tell you now. Is for the, the robot like a Batman? No. Um, for the longest, I thought Bleach had, like, the best shit talking in anime. Like, just period. Like, from character. And you I think bound to be overpassed. Oh, but see, the thing is, though, is that Bleach is longer, so you get more of it, of the shit talk. But if you telling me, like, just on line, one-liners and just pure and just the dialogue and shit in there, Black Lagoon is just... It's up there. Bro, it, bro it's, is it's, the, it's... Is the dub good? It, yes, now I'm watching it in dub. That, Cause that's what matters. That's what's getting me right now. Are they I'm using watching the it same fucking dub. voice actors that's not trying too hard to get variation? Honestly, I don't know, but the dub is just that damn good because the dub. So is you ain't portray- heard no voices that you kind of that you typically used to. Uh, not necessarily. Like I feel like no, I feel no, no, no. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel no, I feel like I feel like Piccolo's. Like I feel like I feel like else. the dude who does Piccolo's voice. Does the black dude on that show, and there's a whole kind of like '90s references on there because they're not sipping Heineken; it's a Hurricane mm-hmm. can on there and shit like that. So yeah. they got kind of like these little. Oh no, it, it, it's it's crazy, bro. But it's a it's a, it's a dope it's a dope ass show. My boy Colin had put me on it a while back, but I just wasn't paying attention to it fully, fully. You know what I'm saying? Like I had only seen a few, but now going back and rewatching it, nigga, I'm locked in and I'm like. Ooh, that Titans. Titans, too. I've been on Titans like a motherfucker. Archie be catching me watching them hoes. Titans season four. 
I don't care about too much else in DC, even though DC is setting up for a lot of shit. They actually got some good shit. It, like back in like 2018, you could say, "Oh, DC Universe sucks." Right now, you can't too much complain about DC. And I'm gonna be one to say Titans is lit. You still watching Titans? Cause I know you did. I stopped. I, I had too much shit on my plate. Oh, okay. Yeah, back. The new murder. season pretty good though. I just heard that. I've been meaning to watch it because the picture for it looks dope. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What you been watching? I, I went back and watched goddamn some movies. But let me tell y'all something. My baby mother does not know who she is. Evan McAllister. <coughs> nigga. I'm not, I know I'm saying his name. Does right. she not know how him because, does she not just know the name or does she not know it? Even oh, nigga, she don't know the movies, nigga. Ask the fuck off. She never seen any of them. Damn. I'm talking about, nigga, I, I had to watch Home Alone with my baby mama, nigga. Because she never seen that shit. And I'm like, how the fuck have you never seen Home Alone? I don't know shit. I was gonna say we all did. That's why I'm not. I've I've gotten offended at some people who didn't watch like Fresh or Minister Society and shit like that, and I've been like, like for real, like type of shit, like yo. I'm a lot. Yeah, for real. Yeah, it's not that way, like uh, for, for real. See, I could, like, you know, like Christmas. I was on some Christmas show. I was like, damn, you ain't never seen it. Like, I remember when I was little, bro. Every time, every ABC. little booby trap I've ever done or tried, nigga, I've always thought of Home Alone, nigga. I'm gonna put the fucking nigga up with some shit. Let I me mean, put you this. You ain't never watched fucking ABC. And what can we do with some stir? Days of Christmas, <laughs> goddamn. <laughs> this nigga, turn on ABCs around ABC. Christmas. Like, time. man, does that ice in front of the steps really work outside? And <laughs> go out there with a water hose at night. They try that shit. Really? Not really? work. Hey, bro, you got your ice skates. Pull up. One, y'all, the ones you be taking out to the Galleria. Pull up. <laughs> oh, God. Any like, nigga uh, in Texas that got their own pair of ice skates is just out of there. If you in Texas with your own pair of ice skates there, you committed. Because there's no reason you said, there's nowhere in the world you can fucking ice skate on Texas. Wait, yeah. well, hold on. No, no, no. The motherfuckers who hockey. The motherfuckers who do hockey. They just opened the biggest Naturally. outdoor skating ring in Texas. Ah, uh, yeah. Hey, man. You Grand Prairie or something. But hey, man, any of y'all got some high ice skates I can borrow? Yeah, I got some in my closet. Like, fam, you go Okay, eat. even though I called and asked for these, nigga, what the fuck are you doing I, with ice skates? I understand you closet? having your own rollerblades to go to the skating ring. <laughs> I understand you having your own four-wheel skates to you go to the what's called board. But, but motherfucker, if you go to the gallery with a bag and your skates on your fucking thing, I'm going to ask where the fuck you from because you can't be from here. Damn. You can't be. There's no way and you gotta have some extracurricular you don't activities. Bring your own skates, you rent them, nigga. It's almost 11. That, but that's my point. Yeah, yeah. That's what I said. Like, There's no yeah. way in hell you should have your own skates in what's called. We should. We should yeah, that's why. Yeah. yeah, I was trying to wrap that bitch up there you go. or whatever. But hey, simplest. Appreciate y'all pulling up with us or whatever like that. Oh, we shit. know it's. We know. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we know it's. You know what I'm saying getting up there or whatever like that. Sorry, we started. You know what I'm saying? A bit late. We're going to do our best to be on uh, more on time for y'all and things like that. But really appreciate y'all for rocking with us. <laughs> Uh, I'm liking the setup and things like that. I feel like, you know what I'm saying, like the simplest are getting, you know what I'm saying, we getting back to them a whole lot more and we still doing what the fuck we doing right here. We ain't lost no flow or nothing like that. What y'all think? We may have to revamp what it looks like, but it's not bad. We're going to have to make our shit look bigger. No, nah, nah, we, nah, we, we, nah, we gonna we gonna do the, we gonna do the brain Yeah, because we, we was also talking nah, about doing short. like an overlay type thing. and them short. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfuckers. <laughs> All right, but hey, y'all. Keep fucking pulling up with us, and we will see y'all, oh, fuck. not tomorrow, but uh, Sunday. Stay sipping. If you on YouTube, come fucking sip with us over here on this side, and if you on Facebook, come sip with us on the motherfucking YouTube. We out. <laughs> Bitches. <laughs> Alabama got a food. I mean, uh, 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 Sanders got a uh, Alabama. He's so sick.